Ladies and gentlemen, I can with confidence tell you that we are bringing it back. What is it? This shirt. Honor shirt is back. Yes, you can buy this shirt once again, and this is the final, final time we are ever bringing back this set. So if you missed out on our drop with Apari, we are bringing back all of the popular items that you enjoyed on screen right now. You can see some of the pictures of the merchandise. We are bringing back some of your favorite pieces from that collection and offering them one last time to you guys again. Some of the items are the After Dark hoodie, the After Dark sweatpants, the After Dark split shirt, and of course, the lavender shirt, the Connor shirt. I already have three of them. And the main reason why we're bringing these back is because I need 30 more of them. So if you want to get your hands on some of this iconic merch, it is only available for a very short time. So make sure that you grab it now. Pre-orders run from January 26th to February 9th, PST. And if you buy one of the Connor shirts and meet me in the Connor shirt, I will give you a picture, a handshake, and maybe a kiss on the cheek. Who knows <laughs> how saucy we can get. So I hope that I can expect many of you at home rocking the Connor shirt very soon. Get them while you can now. Now. The last podcast I brought up that you sang Take On Me. Yeah. In, in Sweden. We did it. Yeah. Did oh it. my God, I told you not to! <laughs> no! <laughs> no! Uh, welcome back to another episode of Trash Taste. Once again, I'm joined by the boys, Jerry and Garn, and this time, another special guest, yeah. Felix is back. He's welcome back. back. A year later or more. Yeah, isn't it? How long has it been? Has it been a year? It I checked before. It was 124 episodes. It said a year on you. Oh, so a year and a bit. Damn, so a year and a bit. That's what, is like, what is this one? This is 180 something. <laughs> what, what, what episode? <laughs> more than a year. Yeah. yeah. Well, 185. I mean, it's. Well, it's also, I think, a momentous occasion because you are the first dad ever on Trash Am I really? I think so. No fucking way. I, I don't think we've ever had a dad before. I'm sure one of our- I can't be the only dad. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> can you think of anyone <laughs> who we've had is a parent? <laughs> Like um, at the time they came onto the show, like Raina Scully's oh, no, had- Oh, no, we are. Yeah. No, we are. No, no, sorry, actually, Alex. <laughs> no, 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 edit that out. I'll claim the title. Okay, you're the only dad. Yeah, dad on the show. You are the second dad on the you're, show. You are the Fuck! only person that has become a dad <laughs> yeah. in between so, wow. the first time yeah. coming yeah. on. <laughs> One, That's achievement. Wow. Yeah. Incredible. One fun thing that happened is that I guess, because after with the episode when you obviously announced that um, you're having a, a kid, we'd actually brought it up on tra on that trashless episode. Yeah. And yeah, you yeah. were like, you were like, how did they know? We didn't know. Yeah, we just really get- We just guess. brought it up for <laughs> some reason. It was really fucking weird. I remember sitting here, it was too early <laughs> to announce it. Uh, yeah. And you you guys just bring up my hypothetical child. And I'm just like, <laughs> <laughs> how do they know? What the fuck? You know how women have like the pregnancy glow? I'm like, do yeah. I have the dad glow? Is that what's going on? You're already giving off dad energy. Yeah. <laughs> the, the, the dad energy is knowing you don't have to be the one to give birth. That's just, yeah. you're like, you're like stoked. You're oh like, yeah. Yeah. Right. yeah, I was I'm like, so why, is Felix, why is Felix way happier than normal? Yeah. <laughs> you sat down and you just groaned a certain way. You're like, oh, he's getting ready. He's like, oh, he's, he's, a, he's a dad now. <laughs> that was really trippy. I genuinely was like, what the fuck? How did they know? <laughs> I, it really freaked me out to be honest. <laughs> well, wait, how long ago, when, when we filmed that episode, like how long was it that you knew? It, uh, uh, I don't remember exactly, but it was quite recent. Like, wow. too hard right. to tell other Whoa, people. Whoa, okay, so okay, 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 yeah. okay. I'm just stop making yeah. things now then. I'll just stop <laughs> saying things. <laughs> just, uh, stop predicting things. You freak me out. Why would you do that? Yeah. <laughs> oh, God, yeah, it's like, so hemorrhoids, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. oh my gosh. <laughs> That'd be so funny if anyone's got hemorrhoids. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, oh, oh shit, that'd, that'd be yeah. so hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> These chairs hurt. <laughs> so I guess obvious first question we want to ask you is- Well, obvious first thing is congratulations. Yeah, congratulations, congrats, congrats, first congrats. Yeah. But uh, first Thank question you. is what's it like being a dad now that you're a yeah. dad now? No like, sleep. No sleep. sleep. <laughs> I don't even remember what it felt like to be properly rested, yeah. Really? Just four hours every day? No, 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 no. six maybe. Oh, okay, that's okay. That's yeah, that's do okay. that for five months. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I knew you asked for the reaction. Isn't that just your- yeah, not so bad. Yeah, once maybe. It's not just, yeah, your, early, it's not just your early YouTube career. <laughs> So he was, he was younger. He was younger back then. Yeah, yeah. It's not just every I'm YouTube was early. I'm 34 now. I can't do it anymore. <laughs> oh, God shit. Oh, God. No, it's great. Yeah, it's really fun. I, I, how was it, I guess, <laughs> having a child in a foreign country, especially like Japan, I think a lot yeah. of people yeah, would be curious yeah. to know, like, mm. was it, was it, is it easy? Was it? Was there a lot of yeah. fu funny little things you didn't expect? Or probably more a question for Mars, yeah, to be honest. Yeah, true. Like, true. You were you were like chilling. You were like, yeah, like, yeah. you're just chilling, yeah. man. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's 
It's different for sure. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah I'm, I'm amazed she was able to do that, like mm -hmm. in a foreign country. In, that's in scary. Like, that's what scary. The fuck, were we thinking? But yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, especially because your kid probably has the worst name for Japanese people to pronounce. No, it's not that bad. It no, must no, no, how, no. how do they say no, no, no. it? How do they say? How it? would the Japanese people say? Yorun. That's Your Bjorn. Oh, Bjorn. Yeah. Okay. Because oh, I yeah. was thinking it was just going to be Bjorn. <laughs> Bjorn. Oh, Bjorn. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe. Six. But look, they have the, it's really popular here, the baby brand, Baby Bjorn. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. so you just reference, there you go. It happened just now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They know it. So they're like, oh. Well, you're like, oh, same. Yeah, it's the same. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mm. So that works. Uh, so you got to figure it out. That's yeah. it. It's easy. Yeah. Yeah. Just, just name your kid after a brand. <laughs> Sorry, I just remember. I asked you. Yeah. I was like, is Bjarno, like, is that a bad name? You were like, no, it's great. <laughs> <laughs> and now I come here and you say it's the worst. Wait, 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 no, you said that's a beautiful I, name. Yeah, and I think it's a beautiful name. <laughs> it right. doesn't change the All fact right. that I think it's hard for Japanese All people right. to pronounce. Yeah, he was fine. talking mad shit behind yeah, the scenes. Yeah, he was saying <laughs> the wildest <laughs> shit. I'm like, who the fuck calls a kid Bjorn? <laughs> Should we get our coffees? Yeah. It means bear in, oh, it's so funny actually. Oat milk for him. Oh, and, uh, oh sorry. Uh, soy honey for me. Yeah. Sorry. I'm the oat guy, soy. but maybe- Yours is coming, yours is coming. You got I your oat guy? Oh yeah. You want to draw mine? No, 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 you can have mine. You're the guest. I didn't get Guatemala. Right. You did get right. Guatemala. 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 Uh, nice. Sorry, what were you saying? Oh no, I I had to reorder that. So that's got, for everyone I, else. Yeah. That's for Kai. Oh. <laughs> Kai, you and uh, Alex. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry. I forgot what I was going to say. You were saying- uh, Bjorn means uh, bear. It means bear. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause we always go to the vaccination and whatever checkup mm. and it's always just me and Marge and a bunch of moms. Yeah. <laughs> Cause Japanese dads don't exist. I've yeah. seen one. Uh, well, they, they right. don't go in the. Uh, you were saying that it's not common for Japanese dads to be in the uh, the room when yes. the, the mum's giving birth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is it's a very Japanese mentality. If you're like, ah, oh, I'll see him when he's when he's yeah, clean yeah, and yeah. stuff. And yeah, it's also the worst because they were also you know it's against the. Uh, the rules to go. No, 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 the painkiller thing. Like, no, you should have a natural birth as well. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Only recently, Japanese women are like, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to like, uh, you have to either go to a specific hospital or you have yeah. to like really yeah, push yeah, for it's it. It's not right? common. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah like, so were you in the room? Mm. Uh, yeah, they brought me in for the finale. Yeah, <laughs> the finale. So, so you were just like chilling, I playing ass. I wasn't there for the entire season, but I was there for the final episode. <laughs> <laughs> they gave me a rundown. You know, yeah. yeah. you like, like posted on Twitter, guys. It was yeah. a hard fought twelve hours, but it was worth it. <laughs> they, gave, they, gave <laughs> they gave you the cliff notes. Wait, so right? what, what were you doing then during the? No, they kept me at home. Yeah, you, were, you kept me at home. Yeah, you're just chilling. Yeah, you're yeah, like, I wasn't even allowed to be outside, yeah. Wow. Yeah, seriously. They were like, mine still was the one that had to text me too. It wasn't even like the nurses talking to me or something. Oh my God, so she's texting you, giving you updates? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And she's like, okay, come now. And then, uh, yeah, I didn't hear anything for a while. And I was like, I wonder if I have time to pee. And then of course, as soon as I, <laughs> as soon as I go to the bathroom, she's like, come now. And I'm like, oh, no. <laughs> uh, but yeah, they brought me in for the highlight and everything went great. So yeah, hell yeah. Happy, yeah. I mean, well, Japan's service is really good with childbirth. So that's a good part mm, of all of that. I mean, they, they got to make it good. Yeah. I mean, like, it's uh, a rare event. They got to get, yeah. yeah they, <laughs> it's, it's becoming once a year thing. Yeah. They got to make it as appealing as it could yeah. possibly yeah. be. Yeah, I think they have the lowest child death in, in among the world. So that's I, oh, yeah. I think, yeah. yeah, Korea's, I think, fertility is different from birth rate. I, is it? I can't remember if it is. There's a whole bunch of statistics about it. I don't yeah, know. yeah. Oh, okay. Point being, <laughs> no one wants to have babies. Yeah. Yes. Uh, well, it's because you can't. Because you. When working. is it your turn? Yeah. When is it? I'm doing oh. what you guys did to me now. Yeah. Where you reference? Well, uh, <laughs> well, yeah. well yeah. shit. How did he know? How, how did he know? Did he know? <laughs> well, okay. Well, Am I giving I, off the glow Why don't we ask them? We'll ask them this. When is it? Uh, yeah, Joey. Yeah, Joey. When's what do you mean? You're the married man. You're the, you're the closest. Yeah, I mean, it's probably gone. Yeah, I mean, oh, yeah, it's, you're the I mean, it's something. I mean, I talked about it. No on the pressure podcast. by that. I was just joking. Oh no, I get yeah. enough pressure for uh, my family. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> this is actually gonna find out. Like, mom, like, yeah. Anything compared to going to a family family reunion oh, and true, getting true. the twenty different aunts asking me—that's yeah. like that's like hard mode. This okay, is just like true. chill. All but yeah, I mean, I guess it will come when it will come. This is not any. 
Ent stopped looking at my eyes and just like, <laughs> <laughs> and like studying like, my body language. Gods of Gemini, he's lying yeah. right now. Actually, this is. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I think I want a kid sometime in the next few years. That's what I think. That's I don't. Cool. I don't kind of know. Maybe it'll happen earlier. Maybe it'll happen later. Mm, Who knows? When you're ready, you're ready. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Well, uh, were you ready? Yeah. Do you think? Yeah. Well, yes or no. I guess. Yeah. You yeah. Get, you get nine months to prepare. Yeah. You're not prepared. <laughs> we yeah. Were, yeah, we were trying to like uh, find all the pay to, pay to win our way through, like getting all the, every Amazon baby machine there is. We're, like, oh. we're gonna solve baby raising. I thought you meant the pay yeah. to win for conception. I was just like, what? I guess you can what's, do that. What's that You can do that too. Yeah. You yeah. can do that, I guess, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's, it's hard. So, yeah, sure. <laughs> what's, what's the most hardest thing you've had to learn this as a dad sleep, now? Sleep, for sure. Sleep? Yeah. yeah oh, okay. It really kills you after a while. Yeah, um, I guess you just have to sleep when the baby sleeps. That's the common thing that people say. Yeah, what a great idea, Connor. Just, I wouldn't know. The baby doesn't sleep. <laughs> what do you mean? He's got to <laughs> sleep. He's got to sleep at some point. He's, when he's he got to- up every hour. Oh. Go crazy. <laughs> Shit. Now we're going to sleep training soon and I can't wait. It's gonna be great. You should yeah. send him off to boarding school. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's suggestions. Like, oh no, it's great. You should get the Asian mentality, which is just pass it off to your like their grand. Yeah, well, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Parents would be like, that would have been very helpful. Like, mom, dad, you take care of the baby for a weekend. Let <laughs> <Yeah>. us. <laughs> yeah. Well, that, they, they a lot of uh, a lot of like um, interesting uh, th articles have been raised about how like a lot of people nowadays don't have their grandparents raising kids. And it's like one of the reasons why a lot of people don't want to have kids. It's like, they don't have any other external supports. Yeah, oh, when you were, when you were growing up, right? You had aunts, you had your, uh, you know, grandparents helping you and whoever else. And but now it's kind of mostly on the parents. Well, right? I mean, the grandparents, yeah. right? I mean, it's especially tough, like, you know, in your John. instance, because all of your family, extended family, doesn't live in Japan. Yeah, right? grandparents so. would have been helpful. Yeah, for sure. yeah. yeah, for sure. Coming. I think my, <laughs> I think my older brother, because I've got a nephew, I think he moved back to go near no, my like that. parents' yeah. house. He's uh, like, you just, yeah. no, but that makes do the sense, thing. I think. Yeah. And they're pros at that point. They're like, no concerns. I feel like when you, if I had a kid, I'd be very worried about everything. Mm. Yeah. Whereas I think grandparents are like, nah, fuck it. We'll figure it out. Yeah. Do this. You're fine. It'll be fine. <laughs> yeah, it'll be fine. Yeah. Well, I'm fine. I'm <laughs> <laughs> they're raised a weird kid, I think. Yeah. Mine said it's the worrying. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, okay. You're like, nah. Yeah, I was fine. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah. Are there any like weird skills you have to learn in preparation in yeah, like the nine so months? Much shit to learn. Because I I, I want to know yeah. what I've got like I, what I've got to like I'll, I guess look I'll, forward to. Yeah, what's I'll the help you out? Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> you what's, the, the, what's the what's the what's the? Because I think when I want to have a kid, right? I want to like I want to like ma make him like cool. So I, I would start from day one. I'm like, all right, start showing him cool stuff right away. Okay. Subconsciously. Yeah. Making him think that like, like video games are cool. Okay. I think they will like that anyway. Yeah. They will like that anyway. Yeah, but like the yeah. right video games. <laughs> I'll give like two piles of like foods. One will have subway surfers, one will have Elden Ring. <laughs> he crawls towards. <laughs> and if he goes towards the subway surf, he gets no food. Okay. The, so he just has to learn. He goes to boarding school. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and I then he that. and then he resents me, but at this least he'll be cool. This is the decision yeah. of your life right now. <laughs> the right answer. This is a joke, by the way. I <laughs> That's an interesting approach. Yeah, I'll, I'll it, consider it. Do you, sure. do you, <laughs> you should you should really take this. I, for, for my guy with no children, you should really consider this. No, no, I'll do that. Yeah, <laughs> sure. What, what age do you think you're gonna let your uh, let your kid start gaming? As soon as possible. As soon as possible. Absolutely. Game yeah, but, of family. Yeah, but he's yeah. gonna he's, gamer baby. He's gonna be playing like the worst games. You're gonna be disappointed. No, 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 no. any game I'll play. <laughs> But it's like he's five months, so they can't really do much. Yeah, yeah. My my family's like, what can he do now? I'm like, yeah, still a baby. He's <laughs> like, what what age do they start doing stuff? Like, do uh, do like poke it with a stick? Like, come on, come I on. I mean, dude. you can play with him for sure, but like, yeah, it's. I mean, they, they like don't rattly noises. It's not like I they can. don't start walking for like another five months at exactly, least, right? Exactly. We can speed that up. I didn't realize how long it takes. <laughs> <Hey, laughs> <you know, laughs> I reckon we can speed that up a little bit. No, speed I, run strat. <laughs> <laughs> speed run raise the chat. Yeah. <laughs> the walking, like, uh, walking uh, clip. Yeah. yeah, first words. What, like, what was it like the first words? How long does that take? No, normally, can uh, can Bjorn speak? I should it? know that. Uh, no, uh, I think it's like a year, maybe. A year? Yeah. Okay. I yeah. think you learn to walk before you learn your first words, right? Or is it the other way around? I, I should know that. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. It's How long of, does it take? Yeah, speaking their first words in 11 to 13 months. 11 to 13 Fuck, months. they're he's slow, already, aren't they? He's already accidentally, they, they say mama all the time. Oh, yeah, he doesn't yeah. know right. what it means. Yeah. So yeah. This is a sound they make and I'm like, mom's rigged it. 
have no chance to be the first, right? Yeah, you, you, you're done. You're done. <laughs> yeah. But you can be the cool dad. No, yeah, for sure. You're yeah. going to be the cool dad, right? <laughs> yeah. Well, the fun dad, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, I, I saw you. <laughs> You've written off cool dad. You're like, I, ah. I will say. Yeah. I saw you trying to learn as many cool things as possible oh, in like this <laughs> and a, a shorter time period yeah, to uh, impress yeah. your son. What do you think is like, what's, what's the funnest thing that you've learned that you think will be the most impressive? I don't fucking know. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, these are amazed by anything. You're like, you can show yeah. him anything and he's like, wow. So I don't know. <laughs> be a big confidence booster. Yeah. yeah, it's great. I'm just seeing the big, oh. Yeah, yeah, he laughs at anything. It's hilarious. Like, <laughs> I am pretty funny, I know. Speaking, of, yeah. speaking <laughs> of that, I do love the way Bjorn laughs. He's very cute. He yeah. just sounds like an old he man. He sounds like an old man. Yeah. yeah. He's like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He doesn't know how to laugh yet. Yeah. It's really cute, yeah. I, so uh, funny. I saw you uh, when you, you were learning your skills, you did this, uh, the art video where you- Oh, right. Yeah. The showing off your art journey. Yeah. Yeah. You still and I. I yeah, I am, yeah. I oh, saw sure. it, I don't know, you probably didn't see it, I don't think you're on Twitter, but it's kind of set Twitter into a really f interesting uh, co conversation. A lot of people are like, what the fuck, he actually got good. Oh, okay, nice. A lot of people were very like impressed. It was not like any negative or anything, but it was very, people were a lot talking about it a lot. Like, I definitely don't want to piss off the art community. That uh, like no, it's it generally that there were some people who were like, I'm a lot of people were like, that's fucked up that I took me five years to get to where he got, <laughs> uh, like stuff like that. But I, you know, it was a really, it was a really interesting they video. Hate you because they ain't. Yeah. 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 And I guess you didn't even realize people, you'd cause a bit of a conversation uh, cool. on Twitter. Yeah. A lot of people oh, were talking really about cool. it. Yeah. Like, what what made like you want to get into that? I don't know. Just a random <clears> whim. So where, so what's your DeviantArt account? I don't have it. <laughs> what's the, but when like, you I, 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 you know, I watched, I watched that video and I was watching, I was like, man, I, I, I'm impressed that you don't get frustrated with this and want to stop. No, I, I got think, really frustrated. How, how do you keep going? I don't, no. it's for a son. <laughs> no, I don't. Again, no, a real, <laughs> real reason to only go. Yeah, I just want to draw cute anime girls. Come on. <laughs> Base. Yeah. All right, well that's, I mean, that's a good enough that's, reason. That's, I do get that question a lot and I, I generally, I don't know. You don't know? I, you have no idea what? I'm just way a different man. <laughs> all right, all right. Yeah. He's yeah. built in. the grand sit. <laughs> okay, all right. All right. I wake up at 5 a.m. Because the kid wakes you up. Yes. <laughs> as soon as I saw you doing that video and saw you like, I'm gonna choose to draw girls. I was mm. like, Yeah, my man, my man knows. Yeah, yeah. They you didn't want my culture. You didn't want to yeah, go for straight. You didn't want to go for muscular man or uh, maybe yeah. that's the next step. Yeah, uh, muscles are hard. I think I that's guess. exactly yeah. right. Yeah, that's fine. I'm still doing it. I, I, I found it amusing that you found anime girls to draw easier than like any other art style. Do you think anime is just an easier art style to? Yeah, because yeah, it's kind of stripped down. Of, it's not realistic looking. So, right, yeah, right. I think so. There's, like a, there's like a weird formula to it as well, right? That's like a little bit harder to kind of deviate from, even if you wanted to. Because like, if you deviate a little bit from the anime art style, it just doesn't look It looks look horrible. Anime. Yeah, 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 yeah. You try and give them lips and it's like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> it looks curses out. You make them draw their nose. Like, yeah. What the fuck is this? Yeah, well, like an anime character with DSLs just looks a little bit, yeah, <laughs> little it, weird. It doesn't work. I think yeah. it's because the eyes are so big. Anything else just has to kind of. Uh, yeah, I don't. Takes up a lot of room. Works. Yeah, but it gives me hope because I think I have like negative art skills and seeing how- You should try it, yeah. You, you seeing how it. fast, <laughs> yeah, I do, I do. I see how fast you improved in such a short period of time, or maybe you're just talent, like naturally talented talented at it, I don't know. I don't know. But, uh, you're good at a lot of things, it's annoying. <laughs> you're so good, you're so, nah, you're good. Can you have you're one good. floor, please? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> God damn it. Your, <laughs> this is the cool dad, by the way. What's your, what's your, cool what's your cool biggest, the cool biggest floor? What's your biggest floor? Uh, biggest floor. Well, well, I, I realized the other day, I'm not, I'm not actually a good person. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. Okay, hey, elaborate, elaborate. Well, cause if I'm doing something nice for other people, uh. for normal people, I imagine it's just like, oh, of course. For me, it's like, it hurts me. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> well, like, okay, if I'm driving. Oh, actually, we had this conversation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I'm driving and I have to let someone go, uh. I'm like, God fucking damn you for letting, have, making me do this. Because he was, <laughs> he, was he was in the wrong lane, right? Yeah. <laughs> Completely the wrong lane. And everyone was lining up in the right lane, which we needed to be in. Yeah. And, I, and I was like, yeah, just, you know, go in. So, so I'm gonna let you in. And then two minutes later, there was the opposite situation happened. We were, the, driving we were in the, we were in the right lane. I kept egging me on for the record. 
No, no, <laughs> no. And someone else was coming to join our lane, and I was like, "You should, you should let let them in because we just someone else just let us in." And he's like, "I don't want to." <laughs> I was like, "I was like, you're a piece of shit. You did, yeah, because I pressured you because I made you feel bad about it." I do it, but if no one was in the car with you, you would be like, "I think about all those times where I'm driving and I have to make this exit, and I'm and some saint lets me in the lane." He's like, "Fine, me, because I do it." Yeah, yeah. Me to do it. No, I don't want to. If I ever see you drive, I don't want you to let me in. I know you don't want to do it. I'll, I'll wait for the next car. I'll I think just... it actually makes me a better person because it's harder for me to do it. <laughs> so if anything, I'm better than a good person. No, so I'm why do you fine. do it then if you don't want to do it? Because I- Society. Society. <laughs> society. <laughs> Societal pressure. I would say society is working as intended then because you feel yeah. you feel shame I for not- shit for society. <laughs> <laughs> fucking makes me, God damn. So you, okay, so let me get this straight. Let me get this straight. You're, <laughs> you're sitting there, you know, Bjorn's Bjorn just finally- be the only one. Bjorn's just finally- judging me, come on. <laughs> no, 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 Bjorn's just yeah, gone to bed. <laughs> Bjorn's just gone to bed. You finally get an hour to think. You have met, you're, you know, you finally get to relax and think, you think, man. Yeah. I didn't let that car in. I'm a bad fucking no, person. No, I don't, I don't let it linger. <laughs> no, I, don't, I don't care. I don't. It's not a no, big you're deal. definitely not the only one, but you're probably the first to admit that society has grounded you no. <laughs> well, I think, in that way. I think it's, it's uh, I think, you know, sometimes you do this thing where, okay, I think you, you're genuinely nice a lot of the times, but there's sometimes where you're like, I should be nice here. And you've decided to be nicer. Yeah. And that's a conscious thought that you've made. Yes. Yeah. You yes. didn't think about it and you didn't just compulsively do it. You're like, Exactly. Had the options which is way nicer because you're, you're making an effort but then i feel like sometimes i'm like man am i acting nice is that who i really okay, am but but, but i but I, I still chose to do the nice thing or perceived nice thing yeah. this is too deep for me yeah, this is very deep i think that i'm good but it, it fucks me <laughs> out it fucks me out yeah that's actually i sit there and i'm like am i a bad person that i didn't immediately think to do i the, think if the you nice think you're a good person social you're not a good person. <laughs> <laughs> but it, so it's, probably it's, not. it's also like sometimes you just sometimes you're just also in like the mood to do something nice like sometimes you're just in a happy mood and should it doing something nice always be mood dependent yeah that's a good point that's you a know? good point that's a good point do you guys drive here uh some fairly, fairly often i, yeah, I don't uh, know he doesn't have a license. Aren't I've already driven drive? like, I, I have a license, but I don't drive too often. Okay. Because, right, really, what are you going to say? Well, yeah. I, the reason I realized is because of the blinking that people do. They do use a hazard lights <laughs> as a thank you. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And so, I asked Connor, <laughs> yeah. do you count the blinks that they give you? Because in my head, I thought this was like a system that everyone developed. <laughs> wait, <laughs> this dude made up an entire kindness system. No, 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 wait, people wait, do what? it. I'm not what, crazy. What? So, <laughs> explain, 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 so explain, explain, explain. So basically, what, so basically what Felix is saying is if someone- I don't like what this fuck is making me If, if, if Felix lets someone in and then they go into the lane in front of them and then they click the hazard lights to blink yeah. to Felix say is, thank you, right? Felix yeah. is there sitting there being like, they only blinked once. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> what a well, God, only blinks I, once. I told him. That's a slap in the face. I was like, what are you talking about? I blink once with the hot- That's insane. People use the hazard lights in the car to, to say thank you, yes, right? Yeah, and, thank and I say, I press it once because I don't want people to think there's a fucking hazard. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I might just press it once. No one uses it once. Yes, they no, do on highways. No, on they, highways, yeah, they do. You, do. you do it once as like a thank you. And that's, no, no. they should be, they should be, that's, be that's because gratitude. Because any more than that, you're going to be like, oh, no, they're actually no, no, in trouble. No, no. Listen, <laughs> here's how it works. Three blinks is like, oh, dude, thank you so much. Four, no, that's <laughs> four is way four, too much. No, no, that is just, way I'm about too to much. Get in an accident I do really nice things sometimes. I expect the four. <laughs> just leave it I up. Don't know what to do. Why, why turn it off? Yeah. Just say thank uh, you one, the entire car ride. Uh, one is like fuck off. That was oh, right. <laughs> what? Yes, no, no blinks and, is fuck off. No one does no. it. One that only Connor does it. I so never know that, that is not. What, true. what is this? The American tipping system right now? Yes, it is. I don't you know. Gave one blink. How bad was my I, service? Well, I, I guess I'm just that nice driving then <laughs> okay. because I never get no. it one. How many times do you do it? All the time. Yeah. No, well, like how long? How many blinks? <laughs> well, three this, is like I said. Thank you so much. Yeah. Two is like is all crazy, right. Thank right? you. Appreciate yeah. it. So it depends. You never heard this of someone. This is why you don't let people no, through because okay. they only blink to you once, so you didn't think they're ungrateful. <laughs> so yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. But like, no one's ever grateful enough. We we're saying that the amount of, you know, when you do the hazard light, say thank yeah. you, it doesn't matter how many blinks you leave it on for. It matters. Does that mean how many thank yous you'll give? Yes, it is. That's that's why I leave it at least three. Yes! No! Yes! No. Let's what? go! No. At no, least three! Crazy. That, no, I'm Googling this. Because Google. after <laughs> because three and more is there's a fine line between, oh my God, I appreciate this so much and help me. I, 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 I was driving. I'm so glad you're here. If someone does two to me, I'd be pissed. 
<laughs> yes, <laughs> that's what? right. What? That's what? right. What? Space. <laughs> no. <laughs> and what would one be? One is just a Yes, that's it. No, you. That's it. Oh my God! What are you talking about? One is the same as like getting flipped off. Okay, Reddit is saying twice. I've I've never, I've never heard of this. In between everything. In between everything. Reddit doesn't know fuck all. This is like a language that some people have made for themselves, and no one else is following. (laughs) Like you guys have made up this language. I'm not crazy. Learn this because this is this isn't in any like drive. What the thank you? Yeah, the thank you. I think it's like a it's like a virus. It spreads. Like you just see a guy doing. You're like, oh, that makes sense. I'll do that next time. Someone because because that's how I learned. They do that in the UK, and I was like, Dad, why are you doing putting the hazard lights on? And he was like, Oh, I'm just saying thank you. Okay, that's the most annoying shit in you. Okay, because it, it's always dark, and then they hazard light. You're like, fucking, I didn't. Need that, yeah, that's why you. we already blinked <laughs> yeah. once. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, just okay. like, come not, on, you know, wait, to show real kindness, I just get out of my car wait, and wait, thank so them. I leave. Yeah. I go. Use the the uh, front lights. The yeah, 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 yeah. To yeah. get someone's attention. That's what I mean. Not the hazard lights. Uh, you use the hazard lights in the UK. I use oh. the I use the front lights to get someone's attention. Yeah, felt like no, they th- th- say thank you in the UK with it. Yeah, you can do that too. Yeah, yeah, especially on like country. Wait, no, like it's like what if someone lets you in? Then you say you flink. Because you can't, they can't see your hazard light. So you you flick the front ones to say. Thank yeah, you. but they blind you. I don't like it. That's a oh dumb. That's a dumb God. thing. Oh I hate my okay, God! Yeah. You drive yeah. a Tesla. It drives the car. Okay, <laughs> I mean, you don't drive the car. It's, 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 <laughs> it's reasons like this that I like. Every time I go to a new country, I'm fucking shitting my pants about <laughs> yeah. what the rules are because every rule is different. Okay, so okay, say you are like <laughs> in Japan, <laughs> super respectful driving yeah. rules. You have to bow. After, Three. You have to you stop have to the car and bow. So this. <laughs> so this is something I learned when I was like moved to Thailand. So you're at a junction, right? Yeah. And there's a car coming and he blinks twice using, letting you using go. the front lights. What does that mean? He's letting you go. He's saying, go ahead. So in Thailand, if you see that, that means do not fucking go because I am <laughs> not going to slow down. So, <laughs> that's I, psychotic I, behavior. That's My <laughs> brakes are broken. <laughs> that, that, should, that should not be a signal for that. Yeah. <laughs> you shouldn't be allowed to communicate that. No, that you makes sense. You know what sense. would be perfect that for that? Sense. No, because right. this motherfucker would be going down the highway fucking flicking it the entire time. <laughs> you egg me on when I drive. <laughs> no, no, you, I'm no. a super nice driver. <laughs> no, I, okay. The only time I egged him on is there was a long line and it, the You're Google's, like, just take advantage. Yeah. I, I, take advantage I, of the I, Japanese yeah. kindness. That's what he told me. I, the line the line was literally, it was like an hour long. And I was like, we could do, listen, we're on a tight schedule here. Drive to the front and merge and cut in, be a dick. Right. And you were the did devil it. on my shoulder. And, and he did it. Like, and and we, got, we got through right away. It's a huge dick move, don't do this, but we were in such a rush, so. Yeah. Yeah, yeah but no one feels if you're like, that's a great idea. <laughs> and I shouldn't have taught I him. I, yeah, I shouldn't have. <laughs> he, was, he wanted someone to just acknowledge him and say it to him. But now I'm the good person, you know? I'm not <laughs> <laughs> like, Connor, are you, not sure? are you sure, Connor? <laughs> yes, I'm sure, Felix. Well, geez, I guess, Connor. <laughs> Skip like a hundred cars, <laughs> cut right in before the turn. Oh, Oh, God. Oh. Yeah, that's a, that's an asshole thing to do. Don't do that unless- He also doesn't tip in Japan. What a damn joke. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. So oh. have you, uh, do you think you've acclimated Japan now then? It's uh, been like a, fuck. a year now. I think I need more time actually. You think you really? need more time? Yeah. I mean, it took a long time even UK where I felt like, oh yeah, everything's set up, I'm good. We did right. go to Greg, so you didn't act like that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> let's, just, let's, just, let's just be real, okay? That's a side <laughs> quest you never finished. You didn't, you, you didn't, you didn't I gotta go back, quest. apparently, yeah. <laughs> I'll bring you on. I'll never go to Greg, that shit <laughs> looks so bad. Whoa! <laughs> That's out of pocket. <laughs> oh, What's uh, so like? Oh, so yeah, why, why don't you feel like you vacuum? Like, uh, what is? I mean, what is vacuum? Some, yeah, like I'm still trying to figure out the town hall. To be honest. Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah, oh, that's, don't worry, that's something you'll that, never figure out. Okay, <laughs> that's part yeah. of the acclimation process. You never feel you welcome. Figured out. Figure oh, okay. Out. Yeah, yeah. The day you'll remember it is when you're going to go collect your pensions. Like that's the day you'll figure yeah. it out. Yeah, yeah. There's still news that I'm like, oh, I have to do that, and I need this paper. Yeah, so yeah. yeah you so. know what? Uh, do you have the my number card? Do you have that? Yeah. No, and why would I? I don't get it. What the fuck is so that? It's basically like. No, oh, no. Yeah. So there are benefits to it. It's, it's just, like a this, social security card. So Japan. Yeah. Japan but what's wrong with my actual card? Uh, so oh, Japan, the slip? No, the Zaryu. Zaryu card? Yeah. It's different. It's different. Yeah. So the basically, because Japan is, they realize, we're like, huh, guys, we fucked up here. We have so many different things all on different paper and computer systems that are not joining over. Why don't we make one card that is allows you to access all of them in one go? Mm. Oh, um, I see. And so they had this, they made the system, but a lot of old people didn't want to do it because yeah. they're like, I don't want the government having more of my fucking right. information. So a lot of people didn't do it, but 
Uh, there are benefits to it, which you can do, which are one thing that I absolutely love. If you ever need to print off documents or documents you need to go to the city hall to get, you can yeah. print them off at the Convini no. with this card. Yeah, no all way! You have, all you have to do is show you my number oh card. My God. They scan No, 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 it. it's, it's, like a, it's like a That's printer. Huge. It's on a printer. Oh, it's a printer. A, there's an attachment on the printer. You put it on. No so if you ever way. need to get like tax documents, oh my God. you don't need to go to the city hall. You can just go to a printer <laughs> and go through the options and get all the documents you need to print. Yeah. And like the uh, Jumin Hill, is that what it's called? Yeah, yeah, you can yeah. Get that. The, the resident certificate. Yeah, you yeah, can yeah. get that as well from the printer. I so it's like, only you can eliminate- yeah. You were supposed to go to the town hall for that. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I, you, I haven't even got to no, that part I yet. got the one, right? And it's this beautiful certificate and you, they're like, oh, can we see it? And then they take it and I'm like, no. Oh yeah, they, they, yeah you can't copy <laughs> yeah. it, they take it. Yeah, I didn't realize yeah. you're supposed to go to the town hall to and, get new ones. you have one. to pay yeah. $4 for them to print this fucking thing off. Yeah. I don't know why. And it's on some very special paper with the biggest QR code I've ever seen on the map. <laughs> it, it looks like a mess. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's very annoying though, but just doing anything in a town hall is never fun and, and never gets easy. Mm. Yeah. All right, so I'm not alone there at least. No, 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 no. no. You'll, you'll never feel it's welcome. Kinda like, it's kind of like the DMV of Japan. Uh, and the DMV in Japan is also bad. Well, it yeah. depends on which one you go to. It's, it depends on the branch, but every town hall experience I've had is that I've had to wait at least like, even if it's like super empty. You book like, out your morning and afternoon. Yeah, basically you, you waste half of a day doing it. Yeah. <laughs> Have you renewed your license yet in Japan? Uh, which which one? Your driving license. Oh, that place. Yeah, no, I don't need to do that yet. But okay, when you no, do it, I fun. hate that place. Yeah. You have to do a two hour lecture. No, I saw that. Fuck that. I remember seeing that. Oh, you that. do? Yeah. You just sit in a two hour lecture of them talking. It's like a, a really old guy just pointing at signs saying, don't drunk and drive. Don't. Don't don't drive too fast on snow, two hours, and then you can just get to leave, and you get your license. <laughs> it's ridiculous. So I heard they have like I don't know if this is true, but I heard they had like a bunch of foreigners crashing cars <laughs> in the videos. Uh, did, I I didn't see a video. It was uh, a presentation, but they probably oh, okay. do. It's like okay. some weird propaganda. Yeah, shit. I, I don't yeah. know. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> the worst place in Japan is where you have to reply for the visa. Oh, the immigration. Oh, yeah. 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 That's immigration. like hell on earth. Well, because they, they, it's like also in like the worst parts of Tokyo <laughs> yeah, and there's is. nothing around. Yeah. There's n like no stop Shinigawa. shops. There's no fucking train station near it. There's cargo after cargo. And like, where the fuck am I? What is this? I didn't know there were sketchy places in Tokyo. Like, <laughs> yeah, that place is fucked. And then they you got see it next to like all the dangerous chemical plants. They're like, yeah. yeah, they don't. yeah. You see people scribbling like, I hate Japan. <laughs> or like the on the tables and shit like yeah. that. Yeah. So depressing, dude, Jesus. The town hall is great though. They're super friendly. The what? The town hall. Actually- oh, the town hall? Yeah. Uh, it depends. I guess you've got a lucky town okay. hall. Yeah. Lucky town one. hall. Lucky yeah. town hall. Lucky spawn. The one I live at now is really <laughs> nice. One issue. Shiny <laughs> town hall. Well, the one, that, the one that we used to live at was a major, major area in Saitama. So was it was- a huge one. It was a, like a fucking tw like 12 stories. Yeah. Oh God. Hall. Yeah. Jeez. But the one I live at now is really small. It's There's no one ever there. So there's yeah, no lines. Yeah, that's perfect. And I'm like, yes. Yeah, the fine. small ones are way better than the yeah. massive ones for sure. That was fun. I do prefer it now. It's way more chill. So yeah. see, I feel like you have acclimated. Yeah. Knowing, yeah, yeah. knowing the fact that like you're going to the immigration office, going to the town hall, getting documents is all the biggest pain in the ass <laughs> yeah. in the world. That I would call that acclimation. God, does the Japanese not have anything better to do? And no. Filling <laughs> papers all day, <laughs> yeah. like, oh, God damn. You are finding out that no, they do not have anything <laughs> no. better Japan's to economy do. could uh, soar through the skies oh, and, if they and just stop filling in papers. We've been flying cars by paper. now. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And like also everything's always different. So if you need to, if you change your dress, right? You need to go to the new town hall and tell them that you change your dress. Yes. Yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah, which yeah. can be a little bit of a journey. No, no, you first have to go to your old town Yes, hall. yes, sorry. Yeah, tell them yeah. to, tell them. to yeah. break up. You gotta break yeah. up with the old- You gotta break up with your <laughs> old girlfriend to get with your new girlfriend. And then, and then, oh, wouldn't it be great? I don't know if my driving license could also be updated in the same town mm -hmm. hall. No, <laughs> you have to go to the police station to then change on the back of your, uh, your driving license to get them to put the new address. Why the police station? Because the police station manages all the driving licenses, yeah. mm -hmm. which is separate, but why wouldn't you put it all in one? Why do I have to go to two separate fucking places to do this? It's what, is, what is this that you've just Googled? Flying, flying cars car. or Osaka? We would, be, we would be driving in these if they yeah. all had it all yeah. in one system. They, they want to put this for 2025. Osaka has like this bump up guy. They yeah. have like a big- That's like, just a helicopter, dude. <laughs> yeah, that is a helicopter. <laughs> but, but the thing is, they, they probably won't make it because there's too much like legalities to go through. It's just, yeah. a, it's a giant drone. Yeah, oh, it's it just awful. a big drone. I'm gonna be so pissed if flying cars come out like right after I die or something. <laughs> when, Just get a helicopter. Do we, do we want flying cars? Yes. I mean, because he hates traffic. <laughs> Who does it? It's gonna be flying car traffic. I don't mind traffic. What the fuck? 
<laughs> Actually, no, that's that's, just that's the weirdest. That's wait, 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 wait. Okay, listen, listen. Okay, daily, okay. daily. Why are you telling me to cut through all yeah, of it? Then? Okay. Is because it because <laughs> we were in a rush. Okay, that's different. Like daily traffic, you know, five ten minutes traffic. It's slowed down for maybe five minutes. I don't give a fuck about that. If it's like an hour jam and I'm stuck, yeah, that, that fucking sucks. But like. This guy, this guy, one car stops in front of him. He's like, ah! <laughs> it's like but I, <laughs> internally, yes. <laughs> but on the outside, I'm a good person. I, 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 could, I could feel when you miss the red light, like you're the last car to miss the red light. I, I can gotta- feel your blood pressure rising. <laughs> do, do you like driving? Yeah, yeah, I drove here. I love it. Okay, driving in Japan is fun. Yeah, I, I no, do like great. driving in Japan. A lot of people, you know, I think one thing that is massively underrated is driving in Japan because a lot of people you know, the trains are amazing and definitely do use yeah, them. That does feel like pay to win. Yeah. Everyone, everyone takes public service, so the roads are all clear. Yeah, it's yeah. great. It's great yeah. because there's You're so many the there's yeah. so <laughs> many cool areas of Japan and so many cool things that you just cannot access that's without yeah. a car in Japan. Yeah, definitely. Mm-hmm. definitely. Uh, and I think, it, you know, if you if you don't mind driving, definitely do it. If you, you know, maybe like second or third trip in Japan, look into it. It's, it's really fun. Mm. Just don't drive in Tokyo because that's a nightmare. It's not even that bad. It's not even it's that just bad. Fucking yeah. London is so much worse. Yeah. Oh, I've ne- I wouldn't even like wish that upon my worst enemy. I got my fuck. Fuck, I got my license in London. He's fucking me? awful. Yeah, Jeez. he was like, okay, so this this junction's a funny one. Um, it's a it's a reverse roundabout with a one way system, uh, and if you go into the car, you get executed by a 1930s law. I'm like, what? <laughs> what the fuck is this? I'm like the road's not even paved. He's like, yeah, it's a feature. And then like the <laughs> random taxes you get if you're too big of a vehicle in a certain oh or god, something. yeah, yeah. I, don't, I don't know how it works. I just got a bill. <laughs> yeah. Same here. It's all like taking some kind of roads and there's a congestion charge. I didn't know that. So the- tolls in the UK, what the fuck? You have to go through the toll and then go home after, go online yeah, and then say, hey, I was on the toll. I'll pay it with my credit card. Who thought of that what? system? Yeah. yeah. That sounds like this, shit. Yeah. And if you don't pay it, you get, and if, cause you know, maybe you're going to meet your family. You yeah. forget to, you know, you forget about yeah. it. Cause yeah. gonna, my first thought isn't like, I want to pay this bill. Yeah. Uh, you forget about it. You get fined out the ass for being yeah. late. Yeah. Why would you not just like, that, that's like going to a restaurant and you having to pay once you got home. I think I think because they want to find like, you. They want to get fines because that they can pick yeah, up I mean, so much money. I mean, it's more like efficient because you don't have like a like you know a gate or toll gate where people like lined up. It's still up. fucking slow. But yeah, it's still fucking slow. But so many there. times I've had a toll and I didn't know I needed to pay until I got back and they were you like, "You are late pounds, and yeah. you have to pay three hundred pounds." Yeah. Uh, because I saw like one sign that says you need to pay, and I was like, "Well." I, I've already drove, driven past it. Yeah. So I don't know any of the details that I needed and to do. And you're driving, it's not like you can write down a note like <laughs> on your phone or <laughs> some shit. It, like, that's, yeah. that's what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of dumb. Whereas in Japan, they just have the ETC card, which is really nice. Suck it. Yeah. yeah. Just rock up. That is nice. That, that is very nice. That just sounds like a scam. It, it is. is a scam. It yeah. absolutely yeah. is. Yeah. Totally that's a scam. fucked up. Every yeah. fucking toll is a scam. Oh, damn. It's kind of like I mean, yeah, yeah, American healthcare. Like after you're done, like here's the bill, by the way. <laughs> yeah, took care of it. Don't worry about it. You owe us three limbs. <laughs> you were in a coma and the interest was crazy. Don't even get me started on inflation, god damn. <laughs> Have you had a lot of time to travel around Japan now? Uh, yeah. Not that much. I mean, you've been traveling a bit in yeah. your yeah. vlogs. Yeah, yeah, we went on a trip with Bjorn, our first trip. We oh, went to okay. Ito and Atami. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it was really good. Really enjoyed it. Mm. It's nice to finally be able to tra- travel with the baby as well. Oh, yeah. Even though oh. it was hard, <laughs> everything <laughs> takes like three hours longer than it should. But yeah. no, it's good. It's really fun. Uh, those places were good. We went up the volcano thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Beautiful view of the, Mount Fuji. Is it the one with the black eggs, like the onsen? Oh eggs? no, that's no, that's Hakone. Oh, that's yeah. Hakone. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Total it's scam. Very, by the it way, it is close. Yeah, I don't yeah. scam. Yeah, it is close. Yeah, same prefecture. I mean, that area is already nice. Yeah, mm. we haven't gone far though. Like, I think furthest we went was Osaka. So yeah, oh, you haven't gone to Kyushu yet. No. Oh, Kyushu and oh, Hokkaido yeah, are Kyushu. my two favorite. Yeah, we were planning Hokkaido, to go, yeah. but we were like, that's too far with the baby. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. I mean, it, for Kyushu, it's it's kind of tough because it's like, and, and Hokkaido too, it's like five hours train or two hour flight, but then flights suck. So yeah. And you're like, ah, I don't know. Are really they Japanese flights not good? I mean, no flights are good. Uh, I mean, it's better than normal, but it's still, sad. It's still miserable. Okay. It's like a flight sucks. And if you go with Shinkansen, you can only go to like the very like beginning of Kyushu. Oh, right. And the yeah. rest of it is all cut. Oh, no, no, no. You, you can, the Shinkansen goes all the way to um, um, uh, Kagoshima. Does it? Yeah. I thought it stops in uh, fucking Hakata. You, you have to train, you have to change. And oh. then there's another bullet train that goes all the way down to Kagoshima. Oh, I, did, sure I did not know that. Sure. And there's one that goes to Nagasaki. They have their really? own, completely own bullet train. It's a completely different design. It's really cool. Wow. They've got like a wood version. I did not know that. It's really cool. 
Um, Kyushu Shinkansen Line. Yeah, it goes to Fukuoka to Kagoshima. Yeah. Wow, I did not know that. Show that. Can you can you show the uh the wooden Shinkansen? Is that new? No, no, no. It's it's been on for a while. Really? Because my understanding of Shinkansen is you could only go as far as- uh, Okay. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I just like has brought uh, my first Shinkansen. <laughs> Interior? Wooden bullet trains? Yeah, there's like one that has like a really beautiful- Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, it's a- I didn't know that was a Shinkansen. No, no, no. Uh, it's one of them. I, 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 it maybe it is. Maybe yeah. I got it wrong. There is one that's really nice. Uh, and Kyushu also has the seven- 7C, which is like this extremely luxury, classical. Nice. Yeah. They know how to make it fancy. They make a lot of things fancy. I was gonna say, with how fast the Shinkansen is going, do you want it to be built out of wood? It's just- No, no, sorry, like the inside, they have like a lot of wood in used interior. in it. Oh, <laughs> okay. I mean, when, wait, I saw, when, when I saw wooden wait, Shinkansen, wait, I was like, what? <laughs> what? The friction of the air, just like what? burst into flames. It's just like- <laughs> <laughs> It's like Shinkansen ghost flying. Wooden Shinkansen, that wooden seems Shinkansen. like a bad idea. <laughs> just splits, is flying everywhere. Classic Shinkansen. Well, I guess- Oh yeah, they got their own little weird one. Look at that. Oh. Oh. It's got like a interior. Oh, I think Japan's train culture is just on another level. Yeah. I can see why train yeah, cultures exist, man. The middle one. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah I didn't know that was a thing until The white one? <laughs> train uh, next yeah. to yeah, man. No, no, before it. They're insane. Yeah, there's no talk about everything in Japan, but definitely yeah. one for trains. Yeah. Oh, especially. that's a render. Jesus. <laughs> well, that's not what I look like. <laughs> Have you guys ridden the, not the business, but the first class in Shinkansen? Yeah, the grand class. <sighs> Grand class. It's so good. I've still never done it. Can never, what? Never, can never go back. Grand class. It's so time. good. It's yeah. so good. Because it's like a it's like an extra thirty bucks on top of the green. So mm. I guess on normal it'd be this, like an extra fifty bucks. Is this only for certain Shinkansen? Only for ones that go north. Oh, oh I didn't know okay, that. okay. So yeah, so JR East and West are separated, and yeah. it's only uh JR East that, that uh, has the new cars. The JR because uh, even the green cars. So there's three classes in Shinkansen, normal, green, and grand, but uh, the one that goes to Osaka only has green and normal. Right. I see. And the green one is a lot older yeah. and it's not as nice. And then even if the, you go uh, up east or north, uh, the green is really nice as well. A mm. lot more spacious, a lot nicer, but the grand class is amazing. And it's like an extra 30 bucks. It's quiet. And you get, you get unlimited yeah. beverages, any beverage you want. Oh. You get food, you get snacks, as, and you get your own personal server. But it's more sound isolated. Yes, yeah. yes. Yeah. Way, way quieter and a like fully that. reclining chair. I might That's have to share. Dude, Maybe it's like so, don't sleep on it. The problem yeah. is, is that most tourists don't do it because you can't you can't get the, um, you can't use the rail pass on it. Right. And it, Shinkansen is already quite expensive. Yeah. yeah. Um, so you add on an extra, so, so like the longer you go, the more it costs. Yeah, yeah, but then yeah, you get yeah. more value out of it, so. It's sure. worth it. <laughs> it's, it's definitely worth definitely it. Worth it. it. I, took it, I took it yesterday from- uh, Oh, fancy ha boy. Hachinohe, which yeah. is a three hour, I get fancy sometimes. <laughs> Three hour bullet train, sometimes. I think. <laughs> I think it was a lot of time. I think it was Niman yeah. for the ticket. And I think the regular is uh, so two, uh, so 20,000 yen. The normal mm -hmm. ticket is 12,000. Okay. So it's, I guess it's like 8,000 yen more, which is what, 50 bucks? Yeah. But I think the amount of coffee and tea I drank was- <laughs> and Did they have food. an oh, espresso yeah. machine? That's the important thing. Oh, they make it all fresh? I don't oh, think it's okay. espresso machine. I think it's like pour over, but it's all really good. Yeah. And they give you these chocolates. These little sea salt chocolates. I didn't get chocolates. Well, it's because they don't like you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no, it's, it's, the food's you okay. You didn't blink when you let them in, yeah? Yeah, <laughs> yeah you didn't do full blinks. Yeah. I did get a snack. You do I, get snacks. You do, yeah, you get like no, a little- I love that. Little, it's so it's really, really nice. Yeah. What's, what's your like bucket list right now of like places you want to visit next? Oh, kind of for sure, yeah. Yeah, yeah I was so good. I was kind of pissed I missed out last year. Because mm -hmm. all of a sudden everyone was in Hokkaido. I think you were in Hokkaido, Chris yeah. was in Hokkaido, Martz was like, I'm going to Hokkaido with my friend. I'm like, cool. I'll just stay here. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's just fun. Because it's a snow festival or something like that. Yeah, oh, the snow yeah, festival. Yeah. Was going for that. I, I actually didn't like the snow festival much. I, I heard it wasn't that good last year. It was it was it was okay. Yeah. Like the stuff's really impressive, but yeah. you kind of see one and you're like, this is really cool. That's really impressive. And then mm. you have to like waddle through so many people. Oh, that's never fun. And then you're yeah. like, okay, I could see another one. Let's waddle again. More busy because it's been a while since it was open, yeah, open because so. of COVID. Uh, yeah, absolutely. It was delayed yeah. for like two years. Yeah, 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 exactly. And it, I mean, it's definitely like amazing to look at, but I wouldn't plan a trip to go see it because mm -hmm. I just think that you, it's so hard to do anything on that period it's there. Mm -hmm. All the restaurants are full. Mm -hmm. uh, it, yeah, all the hotels fun. are really expensive. Yeah. It's, it's okay, but I feel like Sapporo is just better for the vibes yeah, in general. Yeah, yeah. In general, like yeah. go go for the city, not for the snow festival. Yeah, yeah. Like this, yeah, it's like, such a cool city. Um, I mean, that area is just so cool in general. And fucking love so Hokkaido. much to do. Uh, 
I always thought the snow festival would just be like a nice little extra if I got yeah. to experience Even it. Even like the countryside of Hokkaido is dope as fuck. It's some yeah. of the most beautiful scenery I've ever seen in Japan. My favorite ice cream place in the world is in Hokkaido. My favorite soup curry place in the world. Yeah, me too. Wow, I so know many the one. favorites. Yeah. Mold the out. goat. And they're right next to each other. It's really, well, uh, 30 minute drive. <laughs> they are, they're not right a next to each other. It's like, yeah, it's like 20, 30 minute drive. <laughs> but it's worth it because you eat the amazing soup curry. You're so full. You're like, God, oh, I'm so full. I wish I had ice cream. Let's, <laughs> yeah. let's drive 30 minutes to get ice cream. Yep. It's so good. What's it's the ice cream. Totally it's worth this, it. It's this farm uh, and in, they open winter and, and spring. Um, but both times it looks really beautiful because, and it's uh, right, um, it's got a beautiful view of Mount Yote. Mm. Um, and so you can have this amazingly homemade gelato uh, and then have with like a coffee milk. with the oh. with the milk from the farm. Everything is Hokkaido beautiful. milk. Yeah. You get like yeah. processed uh, stuff. Please ask me for the photo, I'll send it. Like, Dude, I'm t- like, we've, we've said this on the podcast in the past. Oh, Hokkaido okay. has just like God-tier perfected food. God tier food. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's so I'm good. I'm actually not a fan of their milk. Uh, well, it's your cringe gun. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's just way too fucking heavy. I don't, know. I, don't, I don't drink the milk straight. Yeah. I have it in things like the butter. It's amazing. Yeah. Okay, it's the amazing. But like, yeah. I remember like every staying in like every hotel in Hokkaido. Mm. Uh, they have like they give you like the Hokkaido. Oh, yeah, milk. And milk. then <laughs> for breakfast, and I take like two sips, and I'm like, I'm not even hungry anymore. This is <laughs> this is just like drinking cream. It's one well, step away from yogurt. Well, it's yeah. like it's like 400 calories a sip. <laughs> yeah. <gasps> That's all I need, baby. <laughs> yeah, so milk. definitely recommend definitely. Hokkaido. Okay, yeah. yeah. There's some beautiful, yeah, really, really, really beautiful well, Yorkers. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't know. Kyushu's like you? fun vibes where everyone's really happy and really chill and everyone wants to chat. <laughs> Hokkaido's more like you go for like an amazing kind of kind of chill vacation. Yeah, what are yeah. you giggling about? What? <laughs> oh, what just feel like we just accidentally. What are you fucking fucking <laughs> 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 <What? laughs> out here? Is this fucking high school again? Shaking hands a little bit. Shaking toes. Good. Sorry, what you were saying? I'm just not fucking. That's fine. I get it. I'll go on my own. I'll, try, I'll fuck myself. I'll play footsies myself. It's fine. That's right. Just get going. I can. I can. I can reach. I can. I can reach down. Where are you? Uh, All right. I, I don't know where you. Is that is you? That you? Or is that Felix? I don't know. Who's this? Am I touching? Is this Joey? It could yeah. be Joey. anyone. I'm fucking <laughs> footsie. Yeah, God right. damn it! I'm footsie with Joey again. I take all the love. You didn't smile at all. Oh yeah, oh, somehow Japan is the, aside from my home country, the, the easiest place I have to uh, get away with the name I have. Yeah. Normally people would just look at my name and just start having a panic attack. So yeah. Japanese people get it, right? Yeah, cause uh, it's Mani Tapo, which is like all, uh, you know, Japanese katakana sounds. Yeah. I've so started perfect. booking restaurants under a Japanese name. Cause I'm so tired of like- Who are you? <laughs> I want to know which surname you decided to pick. Uh, what name, what uh, name have you decided uh, to pick? I, I just chose Tanaka. <laughs> <laughs> because I realized, I realized, especially, especially when, uh, cause sometimes I would call up uh, and yeah. When I would say my, everything would be going smoothly. I'd yeah. be like, I want to reserve, yeah, we got an opening, I got this. And then I'd be like, oh, here's my name. They're like, huh? And it's just like an awkward like five minutes. Yeah. And I'm like, yeah. I'm just gonna say this fucking name. And then I turn up, because it doesn't matter. There's no ideaing. <laughs> I just say this. I just find it fucking Mr. hilarious Tanaka. that you book under Mr. Tanaka and then you rock up to the fucking restaurant. And you're like, uh, reservation Oh, they always, they always go like, huh? <laughs> uh, oh yeah. Tanaka-san. I mean, same with me, so <laughs> yeah. it's fine. <laughs> Trust me, this, I, I, I know it sounds bad, but it works. It genuinely works. That's a good idea. Yeah. Yeah. I'll be Tanaka too. Especially if you call. If, you, if you're calling, it definitely helps. Yeah. Mm. Cause like uh, you can, I feel like I'm, I'm nailing this conversation. It's going perfect. And I get to the yeah. name. I'm like, yeah, it's ko- fun, ko- 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 and they're like, huh? huh? <laughs> I, I, Why I, can't I, I, for, for a while I kept, just kept saying Conan, like Corner. <laughs> Corner. Cause I was like, oh, they'll know that. Yeah. Yeah. Cause I'd say Connor and then they, I'd be like Corner. And they're like, I don't know. The, I don't know the fuck. Does anyone know this guy's saying? Your name is so simple though. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, 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 I know. I'd be like Corner and they're like, I'm like Corner. I'm like, Oh, 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 Conan! Yeah. Conan, I know Conan. Yeah. Yeah. You know, in Japan, you have to be so specific when you write down the name for the bank. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. oh yeah. I had to read out my entire name, middle name, like Felix uh, Arvid Ulf Schellberg no, no, over yeah, yeah. the phone. But no, no, I have to do it. The f- last name first. Yeah, yeah. yeah. exactly. First yeah. name, then middle. Yeah, it makes no fucking sense. But that was a nightmare to spell out over the phone. <laughs> Oh That's the worst God. thing ever. And of course it was wrong. So they call again and I have to do the whole fucking thing again. And, and I'm like, went, it's not my fucking problem. You I was them. like, I can I just wrong. email it to you? And they're like, no. Well, no, that was the worst part. Cause one time I had a fraud detection thing call up. I was sending myself money. 
Mm. Uh, and, and they were like, <laughs> we need to make sure it's not fraud. Yeah. I was like, why? Of it's course. It's like, it says my name. But they do that in UK too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he was like, you know, uh, he was he, he was speaking English. It was, it, was uh, it was kind of the point where I was like, <laughs> I, think, I think I think my Japanese, which is bad, is yeah. better than his English. He was yeah. like, that yeah, point. Yeah. He's like, you know, Lately, Russia bad. And I, was like, <laughs> and I was like, what are you- They always say that, my banker said it too. No way, yes, really? Yes. He was like, fraud must check. I was like, Russia bad. I was like, what are you- It's like, what? I'm not Russian. <laughs> what are you talking about? I got, I got no Russian. Yeah. Anyway, so, uh, and then he's like, what's your email? And, so, and I'm reading out this email to him and it's like a nine hour process of me going, C, B, <laughs> B. And he's like, D. And I'm like, no, 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 fuck it, Z. <gasps> Oh, he's like, what this? I'm like, no. Oh, and then we get to the end oh. and then I, it's .co.uk because I'm UK. And he's yeah. like, I don't know what the fuck that is. Like, I put .com. <laughs> mm. like, no! <laughs> Bastard! Through all of it. Yeah, just my, gives up. Some of my official documents on some bills that I pay uh, just have misspellings as well. Mm. Like my, my instant, and I haven't gotten it changed yet because I've been putting it off, even though I definitely should get it changed. That's very gaijin of you. Uh, but yeah, my-, my <laughs> do, 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 do foreign immigrants have this problem when they come to the like UK or America? They're like, ah, oh, fuck, I misspelled my name from Brian to Bryant. Do, do you know what I don't understand? <laughs> You're Bob now, Brian's yeah. too hard. Yeah. Do you know what I don't understand? So on my internet bill, so when I signed up for my internet, I had to spell my name, spell it again. But also there was this process where I had to scan my ID card and send it to them for them to like, you know, double check right. that yeah, I sure. am a real person. Yeah. And I'm like, there is absolutely no way I could fuck, they could fuck this up. And I get my internet bill back and it still to this day says grant. Uh, I do not know how they <laughs> fucked that up. But no, they're, they're, on, they're in on it. They're in on they're it. Just, yeah, they're like, in on it. just like, and I can't be bothered to change it as well. Cause it was like such a, you, you, you know, when you have to like to change a name, it's just a five minute process turned into an hour long. Oh, no, 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 there's no, there's no such a thing as a fucking five minute process in Japan. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Nothing is a five minute process. No. <laughs> it's, just, it's fucking annoying. That's the worst part for yeah. sure. <laughs> so that's, you know, so I, th I think you're fully acclimated now. You Hell, just need to do yeah. a little bit more. Yeah, if you can relate to all these. If I, yeah, yeah, if yeah, I know yeah, the yeah. pain, yeah. Yeah. it means. Have yeah. you had your bank, like close your bank account as your visa's renewing? Have you had that happen? No. So the bank will send Every time I'm about oh, to renew they'll my be visa, like, the visas. they'll be like, hey, your visa's, your visa's coming your up. Bank, yeah. They don't close it, they freeze it, right? So oh. they freeze it. But the thing is, is that the bastards, they freeze it before your visas run out. Right. They'll freeze it like a few days oh, before, I which I think is so fucking cruel. Yeah. <laughs> Why do they do this? <laughs> At least free, okay, I can understand if you freeze it when it expires. I'm like, right. okay, yeah, I get yeah, it. Yeah. You want to you wanna fucking be strict on this law. I got it, you're right. But, a few days before, come on, man. I still got shit going, I still got time. Why are you, why are you, why are you punishing the last me? Minute to get your visa? <laughs> I, I'm not, but sometimes what happens is that, what happened last time is that uh, when I was renewing my visa, they, um, the immigration just said, we're like, we're like, hey, we want like another month to go over it. <laughs> we and just want to fuck with you a little bit. Yeah, I was like, we want another month. And I was like, what? <laughs> but my bank. So, so the, I had to go to my bank and like explain. And it was like an hour and a half thing where I'm yeah. like, no. I'm definitely getting it, I promise. But I have this thing in my passport that says I'm here for another month. Mm. So can you let me have it? And they're like, they go back. They always go, they always go back and forth with the manager. And yeah. it's like, what is it? Can you just come over here and help me with this, please? Come on, man. I'm, 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 I'm trying to do stuff today. The manager cannot talk to mere peasants. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I must go through someone. That's my. That's the worst thing I, I think about Japan and like service industry is that well, whenever, you know, whenever, whenever you have a problem, you can't just talk to someone who knows the, oh, the answers. God. They yeah. always have to keep going back and forth with someone who knows. So, and it's like, so why? why? So why do they freeze it? Like, what's, um, what's the reason? I think for it's. That? I, I, I think I'm not yeah, sure. Probably, you know, I think the UK. Maybe doesn't close it immediately. I think there's a there's a window. I'm not sure. No. I, I think it's some kind of that justification of like, you know, you've lost your visa, you you know, we don't want- Well, you. as a great man once said, Russia bad, must check for fraud. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe that's what he'll, they'll call me up. I'll be like, why is it frozen? He's like, Russia bad. <laughs> that's all I got to say. That's bro. literally what he said. And I, I, I just didn't even remember being on the train platform waiting and he's in my ear says that and I just burst out laughing. <laughs> I'm like, why in the way he just said that's that? That's probably how we sound like. In Japanese. No. Oh, I, I, actually, I, I sound yeah. way worse. Yeah. <laughs> Russia <laughs> bad. Uh, Let's see. Oh. What's this? Yeah, it's- Yeah, it's yeah, yeah. We, we, we get, we get treated with the, we get treated with the, the past crimes than the frauds, fraudsters. <sighs> yeah. I do. For uh, being foreign. <laughs> One thing, uh, one thing I wanted to ask, mm. uh, which is something that I guess I've thought about, uh, which Let's is, you know, it. 
when I when I eventually decide to be a dad. Oh, now with trash. He's thinking about it. Now with trash taste. Yeah. Now now with trash taste, there is just so much content on me out there. Uh-huh. And it's always it's going to be out there. And I What are up. you implying? No, okay. How do you, how do you feel? What are you actually how trying to say? <laughs> okay, okay, Bjorn comes in, he's like, Dada. What is apology yeah. video? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did that do bad things? No! <laughs> you weren't supposed to. <laughs> Why was that the first video you found? <laughs> Out of the thousands of videos I have. I try to block all of it. <laughs> no. <laughs> because I think YouTubers are getting to that point now where there, I think there are some YouTubers with kids that are getting old enough to have starting to become old enough to really watch and yeah, understand. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah. I thought of that. Because that. there's never been a I don't, I think the oldest YouTuber kids I can think of that like were growing up after the YouTube and all that stuff. Mm. I think like, I don't know, like Philip DeFranco yeah. or something. I don't know. Also, it's just weird to me because you think about, you know, think about your own parents and you have no kind of bearing of what they were like. when No they were fucking ex- clue. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You hear stories and it's almost like alien. You hear a story from like an aunt or an uncle about yeah. how, oh, your your parents were like this. And you're like, this. that's, <laughs> not, that's, that's a fake it's, person. It's actually smart though. Cause you're preloading, like, you know, those iPad kids. It's like, yeah, my yeah. kid's an iPad kid, but he only watches dad. <laughs> 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 He's, I, I'm curious. Is a playlist of the greatest hits to babysit to babysit my son. It's not That's weird. That's really why he watches I got into only the game. me. <laughs> That's pretty good, actually. Would that be you psychopathic? Could, you could probably crazy. you could probably convince your kid long enough to be like, no, no, this is dad talking to son, yeah. to boy. Yeah. <laughs> also, it's I am well talking to it's you. Like yeah. you get the ad rep for us. So it's just <laughs> a circulating <laughs> income, right? Like it's going in the phone, yeah. son. My kid is making me so much bang <laughs> from just watching my playlist. Also, also, you can never discipline your kid for playing too many video games ever again because they yeah. could just they could just like dad, dad. <laughs> they just load up the receipts being like, oh, dad. Bruh. I That's calculated true. how many oh. hours. Yeah. You know, what? okay. <laughs> okay, uh, just while, while, cause I'm gonna forget if I don't say this. Remember that one time, I, well, I don't remember, the last podcast I brought up that you sang Take On Me. Yeah. In, in Sweden, we did it. Three, two, <laughs> one. We're talking away. I don't know what I'll just say, I'll say away. Today's another day to find you shining away. I'll be coming for your love again. Oh, we did it. Yeah. Did yeah. It. Oh my fucking God. Nice. I told you not to. <laughs> no, it was great. show in Sweden. We yeah. did a justice. We sang a take on me. Take on me yeah. in front of the Swedish crowd. It was great. It was great. It. it was great. It was great. It was great. Yeah, yeah it's great. Is it in any cringe compilations? I'm not going to see this. No, it was in the <laughs> epic win compilation. It's like Fail Army. It was, so was mine. <laughs> so was mine. <laughs> no, no, it wasn't. I, this song's going to see that and be yeah. like. It's a, it's a fun song to sing. It, 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 was, it wasn't the same because there wasn't like the shot of just the crowd having the Thousand Islands there. They did me dirty. <laughs> that was a, that was the first ninja moment. You know, when he's like, why am I, I'm not seeing enough movement. Okay, yeah. we don't need first. to bring up this. Bjorn will not see these videos. <laughs> yeah, actually, that will not be in the curated playlist. <laughs> <laughs> Dad, yeah, this whenever, is cringe. Whenever, 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 <laughs> yeah, whenever Bjorn does something bad and you're like scolding him, he'll just be like, <laughs> don't test yeah, me, Dad, I have the receipts. <laughs> just pulls oh, it God. off your iPad. I just realized, yeah. It's too much. <laughs> well, I mean, I think it's fun too. Like, we're f- that'll be really fun. I think. Yeah, that'll be, I, yeah. be cool. Yeah. And we're doing the vlogs now. Like, I didn't have any videos of me as a kid, mm-hmm. so yeah. I have no idea what it was like. So I think it'll yeah, be fun too. to to watch that kind of yeah, stuff. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, because the, the you did, did you have those like family photo books when you were growing up? Oh, totally. Yeah, yeah. and there's you could you could kind of figure out roughly what was going on. But it feels so it feels so cool looking at like just a still of. of yeah, we watch those forever. Oh, like, yeah. I, I, yeah. I have a shitload of like family videos because my I do really. Well. Yeah. I, I didn't have any. No. It'd be so cool. Yeah, I, yeah. I kind of wish that like yeah. I think it'd be so cool for my kid to see me like twenty just doing my thing. Yeah, oh, that'd be dude, so I would love sick. to see my parents it's, too. It's yeah. painful to watch. Yeah, yeah but it'd be cool, dude. Like, I'd love to see my dad when he's twenty doing yeah. his thing. Yeah. It'd be yeah. so sick. Like I, I kind of feel like that secondhand embarrassment of like, damn, I was cringe as fuck. Like when, whenever I look at some of these videos, because I'm just like, nah, I wouldn't. But I wouldn't like, okay, that. but like, I wouldn't say that. Like, <laughs> I, I think you know, you'll, 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 you'll like, 
you know, if you have a good relationship with your dad, you'll love your dad and you'll be like, man, it's so fucking cool just seeing my dad. Yeah, I think so. Oh, no, my my parents use it to roast the shit out of me. (laughs) (laughs) Well, there are two types of memory keeping. One one to to fuck someone over. Whenever whenever my dad puts on like a family video of me and my sister and like, you know, I'm like like four years old, five years old. That's just cute. Yeah, Yeah, yeah. no, like my mom is sitting there being like, oh, look at you, you're so cute. My dad's like, no, look at you, your balls haven't dropped yet, you're little shit. (laughs) (laughs) Bro, he's roasting a fucking- How old are you? Roasting a toddler. Bro can't fight back, man. <laughs> Why is he roasting toddlers? <laughs> you sound like a squirrel. <laughs> you need puberty at a four. Your dad, your dad was 100% the kind of dad that when you all started doing like sports, yeah. he was like, fucking Joey, fucking why are you winning shit, you piece of shit. Yeah. It's like, you lost, that's cringe. <laughs> <laughs> That's the dad I strive to be. <laughs> oh my uh, God. The, the, like the one family uh, video I remember was like my dad trying to, like my dad taking me to, uh, my parents taking me to the playground. Yeah. And my mom just lets me play around and stuff. And my dad's like the fucking, the fucking grind set guy. Mm. He's like, I get on the monkey bars <laughs> and I give up halfway. And he's like, go on it again. <laughs> really? He's, he's, he's like, son, we don't son, quit in this house. In again. Don't, don't quit halfway through. And I go on in again, give up. And he's like, no, I'm going to pick you up. And you're gonna learn how to do these monkey bars. Oh, really? Yeah, that's and, cute. Uh, that's wholesome. Yeah, do you yeah. find that helpful? Uh, I d- <laughs> too young to say. I was too young. Okay, but I just mean in general. I'm I trying feel- to understand what's the good parenting. <laughs> how okay. do you psychoanalyze me, please? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I feel like letting them learn a little bit on their own is a good way because yeah. I remember I one of the reasons why I how long how old were you guys when you learned how to ride a bike? I was. Oh, six. I, think I just unlocked a memory. I remember. I don't remember. I remember being, in, remember? My, yeah. I remember I was like being in my driveway and doing it when I was like. I really feel like young, I taught six. myself. I don't remember. Really? Oh yeah. shit! Did you ever have like the training wheel phase? Or yeah, oh, I did have. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. Of course, yeah. Fucking tore it up. Yeah. So like, my when my dad tried to teach me how to ride a bike, uh, he just completely skipped the training wheel stage. <laughs> <laughs> he was just like, he, he was just like, get good. And I, <laughs> Riding get a good, bike son. is a mindset. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> it was like, son, you just gotta grind it out. If you fall over, don't worry, just get up and Stop just being gr- a fucking pussy. <laughs> just grind Take it out. The wheels off. Well, not the parent goes with the kid, right? So they hold Holding it in case they're like- Yeah, yeah, my, yeah my dad yeah. used to like ho- like hold the back of the bike and then he'd be like, all right, I'm gonna let go. And I'm like, dad, please don't. <laughs> and when he'd do it anyway, and then yeah, I'd get you fall. And you, you fall and then you get hurt, you cry, you try again and then eventually you do it. Yeah. I think that's his Asian dad. I think that's just an Asian <laughs> dad. Asian yeah. Parenting. Yeah. Got a scar here that lasts forever. Yeah. I'm, yeah, I think my parents were just like, please stop. Cause I just kept doing dumb shit. I used to like, you know, I'd see a bump and I'm like, I'm gonna jump. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I was, I was too much of a pussy to do stuff like that. I, I just think. had no sense of fear as a kid. And then I mm-hmm. got it when I fell really badly one time when I was like 15. And Everyone's like, gonna learn somehow. And yeah. I was like, oh fuck, you this fuck, is scary. You fucked around and found this out. This is fucking <laughs> scary. Like yeah. it really fucking hurt. I was yeah, like, Christ. Like that. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's how all those Red Bull fucking athlete people become those crazy people. They're just yeah, like- they just they, never they, fell. They just, don't get hurt. <laughs> they just don't get hurt for a long enough of a time until yeah. they're an adult and then they, they can't learn it now. They're yes. like, all right. I'll break my arm. Or they're like, oh, well, it didn't kill me. So I guess I'll, I yeah. can do it again. Yeah, those Red Bull sponsorships pay too good. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah I can't turn back now. I got to do the free running championship in the slang. I know, sometimes I see how far the adrenaline junkies go and I'm like, how? I kind of get it. You, I love it. Yeah, you love, have a little bit of that. I love you it, have a yeah. little bit yeah. of that, but there's a certain moment where- Like bungee jumping, I, I would have been doing, love to do that all day. That was so really? fun. Really? Yeah, it was really Hell fun. No, I would, would never do would that. Would you do like, I don't know what the actual name is, but the one where you just jump off a fucking cliff with a- Free diving? Is that yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, with a, with a, a paragliding? <laughs> yeah. really bad. Oh, that. That just seems like instant oh, death. Paragliding, I really want to. <laughs> what, I really want to do my that. My intrusive thoughts would take over. I'm like, <laughs> what if I just- Yeah, but you'd have a guy who steers it for you. Cause Wait, you can't, you can't no, do no, it. No, no, when, no, when no, when no. You mean the you. squirrel suit thing, right? That, that be, looks fucking like, sick. I want to okay, do that. that looks, what? I want to do that. It looks so fun. All right, let's make that nice looks cool. cool. I, 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 gotta train. Cool. I gotta train, I gotta train, I gotta train. It looks cool, but when I'm not doing it. Yeah. I, I would glad, if, if you told me like, Connor, we could hook it up. You can go and learn how to do it. I'd love to, that'd be what so I, What fun. I've always wanted to know is how do you learn how to do something like this? Because presumably <laughs> it's, an, issue, it's it? an activity. If you fuck up once, that's the well, it's, it's like skydiving, right? You have to do X amount of hours, like tandem with a professional and, and like really like learn how to do it. You have to do a lot of hours. Like a lot of these jobs, like, like, like cave diving requires hundreds of hours mm, like yeah. of experience. That's how a lot of them manage. So it's just, you just have to be a hobby and Boy, do it with an instructor a lot. Yeah, it's, right? it's yeah. really, yeah. really, you have to really, really be dedicated to it. Mm. Um, 
But obviously it pays pretty well when you do it, when you do get certified yeah. or whatever, because no one else is fucking doing it. I think the most extreme <laughs> thing I would attempt to learn or attempt to do is scuba diving. I really want to go dive, yeah. scuba diving. But that's not extreme. It's kind of, it's super dangerous. <laughs> it's pretty fucking dangerous. You go, yeah, it depends how deep you go, but. Yeah. How pretty, deep are we uh, talking? Even well, going like 40 meters is really, whoa, really yeah. like. That doesn't sound much. That sounds like 40 meters is that's so deep. much. What? That's so Wait, deep. Dude, I, 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 I would stand up. Oh yeah, how, how, <laughs> I, 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 <laughs> that's nothing. <laughs> yeah, I, I, at, which, at which point does sunlight stop penetrating? Like, it's like five meters. Nah. Yes. Well, even no, no, like even like free diving without okay, like- Okay, first of all, you first of all, with, with scuba diving yeah. at like 40 meters, you have to start decompressing. And that's yeah. the scary yeah. part. Yeah. You just sit there in the water for like an hour. Yeah. Just you, you, tank, can't, you, just can't just, you, you can't just, you can't just, just, just tank, tank it. it. <laughs> People do and they die. That's a beta <laughs> shit. It's just kill it. <laughs> okay. uh, I'll Google the, okay, while you Google Cause that, I've, Google Cause I've done thing. in the Philippines, I did the thing where like you put on that like water uh, helmet. Oh, I saw that on your blog. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then you, you go to, that was 10 meters. Oh, okay. And that was a lot on your body. Oh really? And it doesn't feel like any, like you look up and it's like, oh, I'm not even that far from yeah, the surface, yeah, yeah. but you just, you feel that pressure, the pressure as you're oh, going okay. down. Like uh. your body just gets so heavy. And I'm like, yeah. at, I can't imagine going double that. Okay. At the first yeah. 10 meters, wow. water already absorbs more than 50% of visible light. That's at 10 meters. Yeah. Um, Depths below a thousand meters receive no light from the surface whatsoever. You said 40 for the yeah, record. Yeah, we said 40, so. Fucking idiots. <laughs> But the amount of- <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying Jesus, it's, it's, it's already, it's already, at 40 meters, I think it's already Wait, really no, fucking no, dark. No. Yeah, it gets in the water, but there's so much shit in the water, yeah. like dirt and stuff. <laughs> that you're not gonna be able to see anything. Well, I don't want to scuba there. <laughs> well, yeah, cause it's like the amount of just the amount, it's not even the sunlight thing or anything. It's just the amount of pressure on your body at 40 meters is so much for your body that if you immediately like just come up to the surface, you yeah. get, you get fucked up. This seems like the kind of thing I have no knowledge of, and that's why I'm just like, <laughs> that seems silly. Just float. Well, yeah. <laughs> just hold your breath. Come on. <laughs> What's the big deal? Just swim up. <laughs> just, <laughs> just swim up. I'm trying to find how long you'd have to wait. Uh, to I don't know how long. You'd, you'd be waiting, which is the scariest part, because you're like, what if something goes wrong? And you know you need to decompress. Okay, yeah, the theory it says according to some sources, the theoretical limit of human body pressure underwater is a thousand meters, which is a hundred atmospheres of pressure. That's the theoretical limit. That's the theoretical <laughs> limit. I mean, people people dive to like a hundred something. Yeah, um, which is crazy. And that's still insane. Yeah. Well, the reason why I think you can dive off of breath way deeper and come back up no issues mm. than you can if you use the tank. Mm. Cause the tank uses different- uh, uses Oh, different is that tank. why? Oh, okay. It uses like a, uh, a nitrogen uh, mix, uh, not nitrogen. Um, 60 meters is some. I don't know what, what, what's in a scuba diving tank. It's, it's like a mix between, a, it's a very concentrated thing that helps decompress you not to compress you, like keep you your head not hurting while you're diving. Seventy nine percent nitrogen, twenty one percent. Yeah, it's nitrogen. Okay, what's right? It's like a nitrogen, and so then when you're coming up, the the you'd have like bubbles in your blood. Otherwise, oh, right. if you can't yeah. too fast. Mm. They fuck you. Yeah, it's really fucking scary. Yeah. What's your blood boils? What's the most hardcore you would do, man? I don't. I, fuck a sheep. <laughs> I would do like sheep. Sure. That's <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah. That's, that's just in your bloodline. Yeah, come on. Sorry, 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 sorry. Oh, I Let feel. <laughs> You want to go skydiving, right? I want to do, do skydiving. Oh, yeah? Let's could, do skydiving. I could do like jumping off stuff at a. Depending you on the you want to do bungee jumping? Yeah, I would do jump. I think so I fun. I think, feel like I judge you, uh, Joey, but uh, I, I, yeah, I'm not doing anything. Yeah. Do you it's want to do bungee scuba, jumping? Scuba, no. Dude, it's so fun. I don't, I don't care. Do, you I've seen, I've seen the videos. I wouldn't do bungee jumping, but I would do skydiving. Wait, what? Oh, I'm not scared of Fuck that. Because Why? to me, like it, my my like whole thing of it is, I am more scared of like the awkward height than I am like the really really high heights. But you know what I mean? I I kind of yeah, I kind of like I'm okay. Like people, when people are like afraid of heights, right? Like there's lots of different levels. I feel like I'm not afraid going on like an airplane. Like even though you're a lot higher, right? Yeah. But I get the most nervous. The most nervous I get with heights is when you're like- Looking over a- Looking over like a 10 story building. Dude, it's so fun though. That's, I get, uh, and like- Do you so get me, that voice in your head that say that would be cool to jump? No, my in my head, <laughs> no, is that just me? No, in my head, in my head, I'm just like, I better step away before someone but that's, pushes that's me That's what's over. so good about bungee jumping uh -huh. is that yeah. you get that voice and you're like, let's do it. Nah. And then you get nah, like, you get I'm this good. beautiful moment where for about a second, you are just, speeding up weightlessness mm. and there's not, you feel nothing, but just 
fucking the ground rushing towards you. It's so that cool. That sounds terrible. No, it's amazing. It's such a rush. Yeah, but like- I've to, had nightmares me, like that. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. I don't want to relive that. It's so fun. And then and then you get the fun part of the bungee where you get to fly. It's really it's fun. It's just a scene from yeah, Inception, right? That's, yeah. that's, how you get, oh, yeah. that's how you get the kick. You just get jolted away. Well, but like to me, skydiving is way less scary than bungee jumping for- kind it of, is, I, I think it's actually, I think skydiving is also safer than bungee jumping. I would. I think I would, I, I, I'm then. pretty sure there's more deaths in bungee think jumping. I've heard about I've heard this yeah. as well. Yeah. Because uh, uh, well, a lot of the places where you can bungee jump um, are not. Uh, they're regulated. not the best. Yeah, they're not, they're not, they're not the best. Super well regulated. They're like rocky yeah. ravines. So it's well, like, it's it's kind of like some dude and his cousin who bought a bungee cord and were like, "Let's do it." Yeah. yeah I would trust Japan with bung bungee jumping. Yeah, Japan is the one place I was yeah. like, I, I'll definitely do bungee jumping here. <laughs> yeah, I. I wouldn't I, trust any other. But but also like another big thing is that you know if. Okay, worst case scenario, something goes wrong in skydiving versus something goes wrong in bungee jumping. Mm. I feel like- They're both bad, they're both fucked. They're, they're both bad, yeah. but I feel like at the height you're jumping at skydiving, you're you're just like, it's, it's just instant death. Actually, right? no, no, it's not. No, no. Yeah. Is it not? Yeah. No, because terminal velocity. So there's a, a certain point you reach the max speed you could go, which is like, I think it's, how many stories is it? Can you go what is max velocity for falling off a building? I think it's like uh, it's 20 stories or something. So it's like this, you jumping from like 50,000, the same for your body landing is jumping from like, uh, we'll find out now. Um, and if you land in trees. Uh, all right, if you land in trees, yeah, but that's I'm like moment. assuming like open field. Were you just gonna give up? Yeah, Come yeah. Just, I, look, I feel less stress knowing that I have I can do nothing to save myself. Whereas if I'm like- You gotta try. Oh. But if, if I'm jumping off a cliff, I'm like, well, it's gonna be um, like the worst pain in my life, but let's just break my legs someone, and most of my back. Some, you know? Someone says, some dude on a forum says, you'd reach terminal velocity in about four and a half seconds of falling. That's pretty quick. Yeah, four so, and a half wait, seconds? so four and a half seconds, uh, let's say that guy's right, which you might but not But it's be. still pretty fast. Uh, yeah, it's very, yeah, but like the, it's, you're saying like that's like the difference. 120 miles an hour, it says. Yeah, so that's like this, you know, you jumping from a, a big building would have the same effect on your body when you yeah. land as jumping from a, a 50,000, Right, that makes yeah. sense. Yeah. Um, so, Garn, you would just find like concrete to fall on or something. You'd be like, <laughs> yeah. I just want this over with. I just, just, just like, just like make it quick. Make is it, it isn't your best bet. What if there was a pool <laughs> right next to it? Would you not land in the pool? No, no, you die if you hit oh. the pool. Oh, shit. Because the right. surface yeah. tension yeah, yeah, of the water. Yeah. Yeah. What, where should you land then? No. Uh, you should land on the ground and spread yeah. out. Take, like your take, body the, take the guarantee full damage death. Is that like the <laughs> elevator thing where you're just supposed to lay down? Yeah, because you're, you're, all the force is being distributed across your body. I heard you're just supposed to land in trees. That's all I know. I think trees is, is good because you have a chance of like hitting a bunch and stumbling before you, are, are you, are you If you're in like- Do you or is that just in cartoons? <laughs> well, I think if you can, any way you can kind of kill the speed before you land is good. Uh, even if it yeah. hurts a fuck ton. Sure. Well, because like someone, what was it? That woman in the gorilla People suit. People have survived. She survived with the gorilla suit when her parachute didn't. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Google this. Gorilla suit, gorilla suit save skydiver. Type that in. That's so close. She was where it was a charity skydiving event, I believe. And yeah. she jumps out with this gorilla suit. Yeah. Uh, and uh, I think Colorado's one and arm falls skydiver. two miles. Uh, I think it was. Well, people do live. But gone, you were yeah, just yeah. falling. It's same with like, same with like, uh, same with like airplanes, like, like uh, people who grab onto like debris or something. Yeah, yeah. really help. Like that uh, increases your chances massively mm. of surviving. Okay, but here's the thing: hypothetical situation. Okay. Do you try to survive in that situation? Yes. Or yeah. Do you yeah, just? Yeah. 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 Am I the only one who is just like? Yeah. I guess. I, I guess my guess time has come. You're too <laughs> content <laughs> with dying. <laughs> you just want to die, God. It yeah. sounds like you want to. Okay. Die. Okay. If if you're in like if you're in a, like a plane a uh, plane crash. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you like just you know go to the brace position? Brace and think, position all the way. <laughs> oh, okay, if there's a, if there's a one shot chance I can survive. Awesome. Yeah, I'll, I'll take just, it. I'm taking Are a you chance. You look around, and everyone doing the brace, and you're like, what a fuck. <laughs> yeah. I'll be like, stands up. I'll be like, guys, I'll be like, guys, well, it's like, guys, well, been a good run. And <laughs> let me just take the pain, please. Yeah, yeah. That's the only time. <laughs> I'm the emergency. Like, I'm I, 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 I never, I never, I've never smoked like cigarettes, but the one time I think I would smoke a cigarette is if I know I'm about to die. Yeah. And I'm like, All right, well, fuck it. <laughs> Who's gonna lie? <laughs> I just feel like a, an appropriate response to dying, you know? I had a moment where I was trying to find like what to do in all these like hypothetical scenarios. Yeah. Yeah. And it was so irritating trying to find the answers. Cause you just, it's like, yeah, you're probably fucked. Cause even if you survive a plane crash, right? Odds are you're flying over the ocean. Yes. Which makes it immediately fucking impossible yeah, difficulty. You're, you're just done. Just and, then, and, then, the and then the question is in my head, I'm like, do I have, do I have it in me? 
to want to survive once I survive this crash. That's what I'm saying. Do yeah, I, I want to go through the, all the people trying to find me? Do I want to have to survive? This sounds like a fucking ball ache. I'm gonna, <laughs> this just sounds like too much work. I'd rather <laughs> die instantly. Actually, you know what? I'm on God's side now. <laughs> ah, fuck this. Damn, right, It's just man, a fucking man. hassle, isn't it? Yeah. I remember there was one where it's like- I'll just reset fall, the server. <laughs> <laughs> if you fall through ice, yeah. I was mm -hmm. like, okay, what do I do? Like. That could happen. Like, like an ice an lake? lake? Oh, yeah. You walk in an ice lake, you fall in. Yeah. What do you do? They're like, oh, grab your ice picks to pull yourself up. I'm like, if I, I clearly don't have those in this scenario. Get your go, go, like, fuck out machine and get the fuck out of there. I think you just would grab both sides if you can, hopefully. And then, well, you slide down. I, yeah, get a leg in. I don't know. What, what do you do? Just cry. I think you just fucked at that point. Yeah, it's I like, have so. you seen that video of the guy who's trying to swim under the ice to the other side? Because they put oh, that one. Yes. And yeah. the guy can't that find it. Oh. And his Juicy. friends are like slamming the top. Like, yeah. here, yeah. you fucking. Yeah. <laughs> That is anxiety. <laughs> <laughs> I, feel, I feel like there are some life or death situations that, you know, I feel I could survive. Yeah, where under, do you draw the line then? Uh, uh, where, where do you fight? Name, you name, <laughs> name a life or death yeah, situation, <laughs> you survive. Hundred, ten, <laughs> no, nine no, out of 10 times. Say, no, no, no. I'm, I'm like, even though, even though it's said, uh, like science says I won't, I feel like I could just survive by just the ego of my own way of thinking. Like, okay, jump, like what? Give me, give me a scenario. Off, jumping off a bridge, right? <laughs> <laughs> I feel well, no. okay. Like okay. what bridge? Like Golden Gate like Bridge. Golden Gate Bridge. You yeah. survive. Oh, you no. survive. No, you I don't survive. survive. I feel okay. I feel like you know what? <laughs> Everyone tells me surface tension is a thing, but I feel it's like, like okay, concrete. Just wiggle your legs right before. It. Yeah, Break just just it. just like if I have you know, <laughs> just like make yourself into like a fucking pencil or something. Yes. I feel like I, I get do. it. I get it. And it's just like you, you know, you would you, break your arms or legs. At yeah, best. that's yeah. that's what uh, that's what science says. Who, if, who, if who someone trusts science, <laughs> to me, water goes splash. I yeah, don't yeah, mean, yeah. That, that's what I'm saying, right? <laughs> Some people believe in the. I think it's a. I think it's a myth, but they throw a like a rock or something to yeah. break the surface. To break, but I, I think it's a myth. I think it's actually. Yeah. I, I, th I think that was proven think, in MythBusters. Yeah, MythBusters. Right, yeah. Yeah. Not really. Like yeah. MythBusters episode. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's, it's but like, I saw this guy who broke recently broke the the highest free fall into water record. Can you right. Google this? Is he dead? Uh, it's like type in world record free fall into water. It should come up. Have, have you ever had, had this thought where if you were in like a like a, a elevator uh, that dropped, if yeah. you just jump at the last moment. Yeah, obviously that's yeah, the only out. logical thing to do. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right? <laughs> right? You definitely survived that, right? No, you're supposed to lay down. That's what I learned, but it's, that's not fun. I'd rather just try jumping. <laughs> yeah. Jesus. Jesus. If, if it's frame perfect, I think, I think it was. I think you can get away with it. It's a skill issue, really. Yeah. Angle, has, angle perfect, has frame to be angle perfect. Angle perfect and a frame perfect. Just no, no one's just achieved it yet. Oh yeah, four uh, days ago. You have to pause buffer as you fall. You yeah. fall 150 miles per hour. I'll put, put it in the group. I'll put it in the group. Jump higher than that. Yeah, exactly. Oh, like stronger. Yeah. I'll put, I'll put it in the Easy. group so you can show the guys. Uh, what is this you're uh, googling, Connor? This is the guy. Look at this. Look at this free fall jump. Let's. Do, I want to see Gone. Do you reckon you survive this? All right. All right, send it to you. Hi. I don't know how you get it on the PC. I was a Norwegian. Uh, yeah, of course it's fucking Norway. Oh, of course it's Norwegian. because they have nothing to do. <laughs> <laughs> and what do the Swedes do? What do they do? We play video games. Move to Japan, play yeah. video games, <laughs> leave Sweden. That's why there's so many Swedes online. There's nothing else to do actually. <laughs> That's true. That's true. <laughs> we had the same problem. Whenever I, whenever I played COD back in the day, there was always a Norwegian or Scandinavian person that was just so good at it. And you're like, fuck you. There's nothing else to do. Yeah. I, don't know, I don't know how, I don't know how the fuck you got on that tangent. Basically, okay, gone. you're not fucking surviving. The no, I know, I, like, I know I'm not, but I feel but like you I think could. You, could. you, you feel I, like I, I actually, could. You know what? I think I could. <laughs> What Let's the just, fuck is this a dumb idea spreading? <laughs> well, that's trash taste. Okay, yeah. that's, make sure your kid does not watch trash taste. Yeah. Yeah. Joey, what are you surviving? Um, Kangaroo like, attack. Like what? 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 What is something? What's, what is a situation someone says is like dangerous, but you're like, nah, nah, oh, mate. I, I think ah, I, I think I could come out of this. Oh, a bear attack. A oh, bear fuck. attack. I I think if a bear is right in front of me, I think I get out of it. I don't think I die. Well, really? I know you think that. I don't, I don't know if the bear. I don't know if the bear thinks that. I think that. See, one thing I have to understand about Connor is that he's very uh, like he's, he has a lot of confidence Bro, in things. I've noticed that. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna scream at this motherfucking bear until he leaves me alone. Connor's a, Connor's wait, 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 do you know the different, different bears, types of bears? Yeah. 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 Bro, I scream at all of them. <laughs> well, then you're dead. Yeah. I win. Connor's, yeah, yeah. Connor's nah, attack. Nah, I'd win. Nah, 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 I'd win. 
<laughs> Connor's the motherfucker in a zombie apocalypse who's like, I'll begin the army. <laughs> yeah. Goes out and immediately dies. <laughs> Guys, I got bit, is it bad? <laughs> so I killed what? a few zombies though. Yeah, actually, yeah, it's like a little My one. My Katie's still good. Yeah, so. it's pretty sad, yeah. <laughs> I'll be fine. No, I'd win, I'd win. I ran so you could all walk. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, would you survive the zombie apocalypse? Survive the we, zombie we, we've, apocalypse? We've discussed this so many times. Oh, really? Yeah. The conclusion oh, we came to. What no, position, no, no. How what position you? would you be in the zombie apocalypse? Like, what, what, would, you, what do you do? What, was the, yeah. what would the stereotype, what, what stereotype would you fall under? I'll just be the one. Because like, if I learn anything from zombie movies or whatever, it's just like, oh, the real danger was the other people all along. <laughs> and it's like, yeah, I'm just stay away from other people, Lane. So you'd be like the lone yeah, wolf. Yeah, you lone wolf. gotta talk to people. You need to- No. Okay. Well, we have to stick together. Why? Because what if you- I what? have all the provisions. Okay. Oh, no. oh yeah. what is this? Kids. An OC where you have everything you ever need? In my never... head, I have it all. Oh, <laughs> Odds you, are you, you have- too much Dead Rising. <laughs> <laughs> Odds are you got some fucking poopy diapers and some, some yeah, cans of food right. and you got, <laughs> you got nothing. You're in Japan. We got no weapons. We're done. I'll throw my shit at the zombies. That'll stop them. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm the inconvenience of the zombie. Oh, oh Jesus. Like, oh, fuck. I'll have the samurai sword slicing through. Where are you getting that? Do you, do you own a samurai sword? I will not disclose. <laughs> <laughs> you definitely do. We'll see what happens. Yeah. Yeah. He's, al he's already prepping. Don't test me. He's, he's <laughs> no, all, right, all right, shit. Would that be a weapon of choice, samurai sword? In Japan, yeah, that's the dream. He follows the code of Bushido. Like, yeah. I'll kill yeah, him, the zombies. Finally. He just chops him. <laughs> Cleans the blood. It's like finally an excuse to pull this out. <laughs> <laughs> I can live out my weeb dream. You know that would happen like around here. Oh yeah. If it breaks oh, out yes. in Japan, it'd be so sick. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> prime location. What do you mean prime, prime location? location? For what? We like sucker oh, blossoms and oh my God. <laughs> zombies. Nothing beats, nothing beats killing zombies under the cherry blossoms. I'll tell you that fellas. <laughs> Double points for the yeah. aesthetics. Oh my lord. Everything is better in Japan. <laughs> <laughs> zombie, zombie, apocalypse. Zombie, zombie, apocalypse. zombie apocalypse. Zombie apocalypse in Japan. So it's gotta be okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> they always do it in games. Come on, yeah. you know what I mean. Okay, there's gotta be some. There's gotta be something. That's worse Feels than the Japan. type of guy to like chop down a zombie and then do the. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <Stop. laughs> what are you saying, sir? There's gotta be something. There's gotta be something that is not better in Japan, or is there? Banks. Yeah, yeah okay. <laughs> objectively. I guess zombie apocalypse fixes all the bad things about Japan. Oh, sure. Work-life balance gone. Uh, yeah, uh, town hall banks gone. Yeah. All bad things. So I, think, I guess maybe yeah. a zombie apocalypse is what we need. <laughs> then fix. we know for yeah. real. Then we'll really know yeah, Japan really is truly <laughs> the best. That is true. That is true. I'm, tr I'm trying to think, is there is there any other like famous apocalypse types out there? Or is it only just like zombie apocalypse? I guess like nuclear maybe, or nuclear. meteor. Media, we're done. None, none of them. We're are, all done. Yeah, none of them are like fun to survive. No, you know, there's no oh, chance okay. in yeah. yeah, those. Yeah, right. there's no chance. You know? What about like a long winter, like a winter that never ends? Ooh, Would that'd Ooh. be fun. That's not fun. I feel <laughs> like even just COVID was bad enough. I'm like, fuck. There's out of to no toilet. Right? I think winter, just, if, if everywhere was like blizzarding, <laughs> we'd be done. Everyone would die very super quickly. You think so in Japan? Ah. Yeah, because like I don't think you. If it was constantly blizzarding, I, I, don't, I don't think you'd be able to keep the roads clean. Yeah, but I feel like Japan. That's that's the big issue. Yeah, the because how can you how can you transport food? How can you how can you grow food? Uh, well, that too. But we, we have we have a lot of canned food that'll last a while. All right, we got you know, like right? Japan would figure it out. Yeah. <laughs> Japan's Japan. like, all right, guys. Um, uh, everyone has to take turns sacrificing their body uh, yeah. for cannibalism. So you can buy this bag of rice for uh, two cup ramen. Like that'll be the new. Ooh. That'll be yeah. the new. Uh, that's currency. prison. You know, prison cup ramen. Ramen is currency in prisons, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah. So I guess. Japan will become prison. <laughs> we'll be rich. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> we'll finally be the wall. Another pal. better thing. Oh my lord! If a meteor strikes, would we all die? Yeah. Yeah. But surely some people live. Well, it depends on the size of the meteor. People well, have yeah. bunkers and shit, right? Well, yeah, people in yeah, bunkers yeah. would live. So, so they, okay. Yeah, but there like you got. no, but like you no, but the meteor it depends like, where it hit. Like yeah. if, yeah. if the if a direct no, hit you. I get that, but I just mean like. Okay, let's say where where, where is okay. all humanity gone? 
like no, 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 no. I think it's, it's really it's hard to get rid of all of humanity. That's yeah, what I to mean. to wipe out mo to, mo to wipe out most of humanity is technically like easy, but to wipe out all of humanity will take a lot of effort because some way, somehow, some people can. Survive. We are like cockroaches. Yeah. Well, we I'm not gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> what makes you say that? <laughs> well, it seems like you guys are giving up, so I'll take the opportunity to not die. <laughs> Yeah, what would you, you, would you, you, would you, would you our, our life force doesn't go into you, Felix. That's not how it works. I don't know, maybe it does. <laughs> Just take like it. Goku's oh, you <laughs> said some people would live and you all gave up, so I'll give oh, up. Okay, first of all, I didn't give up. I said we died because of fucking meteor here. It sounds yeah. like giving up. Oh, we're not giving up, I'm dead because a giant space rock fucked me. I'll be digging me. a hole in the ground. I'll be prepared. Would you, oh. yeah, th okay, yeah, that's a question. Would you try and survive like during that kind of apocalypse? Yeah, it'd be fun. <laughs> I would, yeah, it'd be kind of I cool. would describe it as fun. I, okay, I would honestly relish at the chance that my only fucking thing I have to worry about is you getting food and water. It's kind of nice. Yeah, but that's all I got to do. <laughs> I don't, I don't, gotta, I don't gotta do taxes. I don't gotta, I don't gotta worry about like, am I late for a meeting? Like, I, yeah. I just all I have to do is just be like, get food, get water, good. I actually thought about that for my because nice. I had. You ever had those weeks where it's like too much paperwork? Yeah, yeah, you're like too I, much I, taxes, too much bullshit. Like, let's like, just go to the woods. Can I just like go to? Prison, so I'm free from all this. That's <laughs> because yeah, you're Swedish. That's not bad. Yeah. Swedish prisons are just yeah. different. Yeah, yeah. It's just hotels. yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you, you got the Swedish prison outlook. That's not fair. I'm gonna just steal this bread real quick to get a vacation. Yeah, <laughs> yeah Germany's prison. They make you work like eight hours a day. Yeah. <laughs> The manly urge to drop everything you're doing and just build a cabin in the <laughs> woods. <laughs> cabin in the woods would be hype. That would be hype. Cabin in the woods would be sick. Yeah, I, I, I would love that. I don't know. I feel like it depends on how bad the apocalypse is. If it's not fun, then I'm like, why? What's the point of surviving? Name, you're a, you're name a, a fun the vibe first, huh? You're checking the vibe. Yeah, first. checking the vibe first. Yeah. You know, nah. if, I, if, I, if I'm like, this. if I'm like in a zombie apocalypse and I'm like, oh, I'm fucking kidding my zombie parents or zombie friends, I'm like. Nah. Do you reckon there's like a convention for bunkers <laughs> that, in a bunker? That definitely is. And then there's just a bunch of like bunker people who survive and they're like, yeah, this is it. Apocalypse con? <laughs> yeah, maybe they're in a bunker. Yeah, they might be. They're probably in the water there. That'd be lame. I wouldn't want to be bunker boy. I, I, well, where where would you be in the top of a tree or something? Yeah. <laughs> top of a okay, tree? Top of a tree? Tree? He you said the tree, I just said yes. <laughs> you didn't have to. <laughs> this is why you won't survive. You're listening, you're like a sheep. Yeah. You're not thinking for yourself. <laughs> What, yeah. what would be the prime location? What, Australia. If, no, what, Japan, we established this. Come on, the cherry blossom and the samurais. <laughs> I would sit patiently. What does the cherry blossom add to your survival? It's steady. It's, it just, it just makes you feel nice. I would sit patiently at the bottom of a sakura tree yeah. with my katana in my hand, <laughs> waiting for my next victim. An enemy, an enemy comes up behind you. Oh, I see. I They're see already dead before I draw my sword. <laughs> 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 I feel like life would be greatly improved if we did have that aura bullshit. They have an anime they're like, ah, I sensed your aura. What? You know an anime when they're like, oh, I can- Oh yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I feel like life would just be so much cooler if we all had aura. I, like, like, being know, able to I, feel, I feel like we do have aura though. We don't fucking have aura, God. People have aura. People we have vibes. Like aura, like what's, you what's walk the, in a what's building. What's the difference? What's the difference? Like aura. I can tell your strength level. Aura's the moment cool. you walk into a building, I'm like, ah, a worthy opponent has stepped into this building. Bro, <laughs> I, I sat next to Ladybird for two hours. I had people definitely have fucking aura. That's not aura, aura that's <laughs> volume. That was, just, that was loud. <laughs> <laughs> It's an auditory aura. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like a tangible aura that we can feel and look at and measure. Well, this have is you what never, you want out of yeah, all things. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. have you ever felt that when like, say like someone who's like really, really famous is in the same room as you? No, it's because their aura is weaker than mine. <laughs> <laughs> so you do believe in the aura? <laughs> no, nah, but, but, nah, but if I did though, it might would be bigger. Or if someone like you really respect or like really, really like, for instance, is like- but That's, that's your brain doing funny little tricks on yourself. Is that not what the fucking aura yeah, is? No, yeah, no yeah. aura, I'm, I'm talking about a tangible, real thing. Oh, like, like something you can see? No, 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 I guess maybe we could see it. I don't know, but like, you can like actually, like someone walks behind you, like anime, you're like, ah, yeah, I sense him. His, his power has, has become my vicinity. <laughs> <laughs> This should you be hard. I want anime to be real. Yeah. yeah I guess what I'm asking. <laughs> is it too hard to ask? Like, I just want Nen. <laughs> I feel like other people. Already in my space too much. All right, I don't want to aura. Well, you, you guys been footsie in the whole fucking episode. Yeah. What are you talking about? <laughs> well, that's love. <laughs> <laughs> that's a, that's a different that's type a of aura. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh Christ.
I heard you've been watching the Squid Game, the new Squid oh, yeah. Game that's come out as well. You've will that be relevant? Anime? It will that be relevant by yeah. the time the episode comes out? I don't think it's relevant. The <laughs> it's, it's not yeah. even relevant now. Everyone, You're like the everyone one person wrote it who- off because it was like the first episode was so shit, and which it was. It was really bad. Yeah. Well, I, th- I think it's just because the conversation has changed. You know, like back, back. I, I saw a good uh, opinion on it. It was like, you know, back in the day, game shows used to be about like, I'll take my family on vacation. I'll buy them the car they want. Now it's like, I- I'm in like fifty thousand dollars in debt, and I just want to pay rent. <laughs> and so it's kind of like the dynamic of game shows have shifted from being like an extra amount of money for people to spend. Wait, what game with. shows with the car? Well, you, you know, like back in the, when you were a kid, right? You watch a game show, and they'd be like, "What are you going to spend the money on?" It's like, "We're all going to go on vacation." Yeah, in like Disneyland. Wheel of Fortune or like Jeopardy. Oh, I'm like gonna, I'm gonna get a money. new car, the new, you know, and and now it's kind of shifted from. I have fifty thousand yeah, dollars in medical talking. debt. Really? Yeah. You Wasn't think the prizes are all shit too? Like, no, there used to be some pretty fucking good prizes back in the. Wow. I, I feel like I've seen compilations of people winning shit, and they're just like, "Wow, thank you." Well, some game shows, but yeah. there was always like, "Who wants to That's be a skill mil- issue?" You know, like, yeah. who, "Who wants <laughs> to be a millionaire?" That's been going on for yeah. decades. I mean, I, I feel like and, it's not that black and white. I feel like it's gotten worse, but. I mean, back in the day, I remember most of the time people just wanted to pay off their mortgage whenever they'd win game shows. Yeah, Maybe it, this is just my biased like memory, but that's what I remember. Yeah. But I, I guess the people don't even, ha- a lot of people can't even afford to have mortgages that's, nowadays. Yeah, so that's, I guess that's, that's it. You know yeah, I mean? like yeah. it's, it's just change. I think, I think it, it, it's not all of it, Yeah, but it's definitely some of it. And then mm. on top of that, it's like, hey, it's the opposite of what the message of Squid Game was. Yeah. <laughs> but is it fun? Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> yeah, yeah it's complete opposite. But it's, is it fun? Yeah, I liked it. Yeah, oh, fair enough. I good. should watch it. I, I was meaning to watch it so I could form an accurate opinion on it. Mm. Um, but if you like really. trash TV, yeah, I guess I fucking love trash TV. Yeah, you are like, a trash TV yeah. connoisseur. Like Survivor, <laughs> yeah. I love. I love Survivor, even though it's like a terrible show. Uh, uh, it's just fun. Well, what's yours and Marcia's favorite? Trash TV no, show again. No, no, we're not talking about that. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna tell you. <laughs> they like watching Selling Sunset. <laughs> That's such a shit show. <laughs> The, well, thing, I, the th- thing is, like, when you're a parent, you have no brain capacity after <laughs> nine a, a p.m. Yeah, like, okay. I just need to watch the dumbest shit on Netflix. It's like I don't care. Whatever. I get it. Yeah. Well, yeah. the UK has like 15 of those shows, all with like different. Yeah, UK is really yeah. good at making those shows. They yeah. love yeah. them. Yeah. The, one of the most popular shows was on all the fucking time was mm. uh, uh, it was like Home or Away, and it's basically like. Someone would be like, I want to live in Australia, but I don't know if it's right for me. And then they would show them two houses. Be like, look at this fucking amazing house in Australia for oh, this yes, much I've money. Oh yes, I've seen this. It's in yeah. Spain too, yeah, yeah, yeah. And Spain, they had, a, so. they had a series for Australia, they had a series yeah. for like Spain, and they had the whole thing and it was like, it was always like better abroad. They're like, I just like the UK and it? it's quite nice. <laughs> really? Yeah. I mean, <laughs> they never picked it. A lot of the time they didn't pick Australia because it was just daunting, I imagine. Yeah, probably. It's like 14 hours away. Yeah. And it's like, there's nothing there. Just Especially spent. for a British person. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you, I mean, you know, for, like, where it's like, you know, I have no yeah. threats whatsoever when it comes to like animals or like natural disasters no, or anything like that. True. And no. then I'm going into hardcore Minecraft, essentially. Yeah. You know? True. <laughs> what, was the, what was the show? Uh, in UK, you have the one where they show a body part. Naked oh, attraction. Naked yes, attraction. Yeah. attraction. Yeah. yeah, this blows Americans' minds Dude. when you show it to yeah. me. <laughs> it, it still blows my mind as well, because when I was last in the UK, I just forgot that it existed, <laughs> and I turned on Channel 4, and it was just Good on. old UK. With and it's, like, oh, it's, it's, Dude, it's almost awesome. Yeah. I think it's actually, <laughs> so like, it's such an amazing idea, because it like almost desexualized the human body yeah, in a way. Yeah, totally. But whilst, whilst still, Definitely using sex, like sexualizing the body to their advantage because everyone is so normal and not yeah. presented in the way that is sexy that it's like, it, I, that's I, the, I don't find any of this attractive. There's like an initial hook of like, oh, you get to see a bunch of naked yeah. people on TV and you're like, oh, that's clearly just trying to, you know, use sex to sell. And then you, when you start watching it, you're just like, yes, you know, that that critique on uh, her, that his woman's ass is pretty <laughs> valid. Like, his left nut is a little bigger. It, it, it's, it's, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's really bizarre because you go from watching like, if you've watched like, you know, you you see porn and then you watch this, you're like, it's it's the, they're showing the same bodies, but it's an entirely oh, totally. entirely different. Yeah. And you walk away feeling very different things from each one. But that's yeah. how they get past the show of showing naked people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They, it's educational. It's yeah, yeah. yeah. educational. Uh, but I think Early. it just stopped airing. It just oh, got did it? it just got cancelled. Yeah. Yeah. Rest, rest in peace. Ah, so. I didn't even like the show. I just think it's hilarious. Oh, it I mean, it was certainly amazing to show American people, and they were like, "What the fuck? This is on TV." <laughs> It was awesome. Yeah. yeah, UK has the best trash. I'm trying to think about how some really good trashy TV shows. I mean, yeah. Come Dine With Me is also a classic from- nah, That's not boring. trash TV, that's just- That's trash, that's, 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 that's golden standard. Nah. That's gold think it's standard. boring? No, you're wrong. <laughs> So we got Greg's and now you don't like come down with me? Yeah, you're basically, you didn't fucking live in the UK. Right? Wait, I feel like there. people like to watch it because they think like, oh, I would make it so well. 
you you like watching it because you like seeing people care so much about something so dumb. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah, I think like you watch people who like, they get really into it and they're like, I'm gonna fucking vote Sarah down two points. Oh, we did actually win. get into it now, I remember. Okay, yeah. Yeah. okay, yeah. okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it is actually right. pretty good yeah. now that I think about it. We did watch one season. All right, UK citizenship given back. <laughs> oh, it's just the one where they have to get married too. Oh, um, I remember don't tell one. the bride. Don't tell the bride. No, no, no. Is it that no, one? Uh, it's the one where, oh, the guy, Plans to wedding. Yeah, don't yeah, tell yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Like, Which is clearly what? so fake, but it's still so hilarious. He'd be like, I think um, my wedding should be a fucking Ewok theme. <laughs> <laughs> so I've spent, I've spent, all the, I've also, basically they would have to spend 10,000 pounds on a wedding without the bride yeah, my, knowing yeah. anything. My favorite episode of that was like, the, the dude was like, I have a brilliant idea. I'm going to do it on a pig farm. Oh yes, I remember this yeah. one. I watched all of this. And the girl was just mortified. She was like, I'm <laughs> What bored. do you expect? Yeah. And the dude's standing there like, I thought it was a good idea. Oh, <laughs> you fucking I saw, idiot. I saw one where a dude uh, decided to- It's like, definitely fake. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, a dude decided to put his wedding in a cave. He did, he, he yeah. didn't know, sick. He didn't know that the mother of the bride had a fear of caves, <laughs> so she couldn't. Attend, <laughs> so, so the mother of the bride that's couldn't pretty attend good. Their her daughter's so wedding outside the cave. The, produ yeah. the producers were fucking riding heat with that one. <laughs> they, knew, they knew what they were doing. What was the shittiest wedding, Blee? I don't know. I mean, pig one is pretty shit. The pig, the pig one. There's also a few that, 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 that just like were disasters. Like nothing went right. Mm. Like, yeah. I'm in fucking Primark buying the groomsmen suits. <laughs> is there any? Was there any wedding in that show where it went right? Yeah, that's a few. Yeah, that's really? quite yeah, a few. Some where, of those are happy. Yeah, it's yeah. They, oh. I mean, you know, some some of them. It turned out they really loved each other, and even though a lot of things went wrong on the day, it just like everything just. That was always the message of the show. It's yeah, like, feel good. It's it's <laughs> still feel good. I, I wonder. I, I, wonder I wonder if some of them got like actual marriages afterwards, or if that was their real marriage. I wonder. I don't know. I uh, yeah. I don't, I don't know. know. They get a free wedding. Yeah, I guess you do yeah. get a free wedding. Yeah. You put it like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn. I'll play this wedding. I'll play wedding. Okay. Don't worry about it. This wedding is sponsored by him. <laughs> <laughs> oh my just Lord. Me, or has that just been a huge uptake of just reality cooking shows as well? Because every time on my Netflix, it's, they're, it's, it's they're so easy. bad. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's always it's existed. It's so easy to, to film and produce a cooking show. It's not, you don't have to get anything crazy. Mm. You just get a bunch of chefs and, and get a bunch of kitchens and you're done. I'm just like Kitchen Nightmare, like it peaked with Kitchen Nightmares so and nothing has even come That's close so to touching. Kitchen Nightmares. Like <laughs> has, has come close to touching that. Iron Chef. Iron yeah. Chef is good. Watched a few episodes recently. It was really oh, fun. Yeah? It's just a great show. What a great show. I haven't yeah. seen it. What is it? It's the old Japanese kind of, uh, you know, I, I it's think like cooking battle royale. They would cool. have two teams battle each other with it, like, and there would be an ingredient of the day. Mm. And, and it would usually be like so the challenger chef <laughs> would like step in, and then Iron Chef would have like there'd be like three different chefs for three different cuisines, and the challenger chef would have to go up against a professional <laughs> You'd chef. Pick one. Oh, they, they, they'd give him one. Yeah, it doesn't sound good. And at then, all. No, no, but then, but then, imagine it's all in Japanese, right? So then they're, they're dubbing over the Japanese. The, the, dub. dub's, the dub's pretty good. <laughs> the dub is the best. And, uh, yeah. they, they they mimic all of the Japanese like mannerisms in the dub. It's uh, so good. Uh, you go like, how's your son? How's your son? What does this mean? He's like, well, actually. I'm glad you asked Kirimoto san This is how we do that. Um, and then uh, like uh, there's there's like they build storylines. Yeah. So there was like this one I watched one recently. There's a storyline where he beat the apprentice and then the whole squad came, like 50 of this like like clan from this mm. family. He was like, no, this won't do. Beat my better apprentice. Beats the better apprentice. Like, no, no, no. Beat the vice president of the clan. <laughs> Beats him. He's like, "All right, well, I'll do it. Next episode, you'll face the boss." And it's just like, yeah. what is this Pokemon ass writing?" <laughs> but it's so fun. It's, it's like so goofy. Check it out. Oh, it's, like, it's, it's, it's literally Shokugeki. Yeah, it's yeah, yeah it it's literally Shokugeki, it's literally but, Shokugeki. but good. Yeah, yeah. It's, <laughs> it's really some, good. What are some good Japanese reality TV? Oh, uh, well, there's a um, fair few that are pretty good. There's yeah. one at New Year's that I recommend watching. Oh, it's the Can't fucking, Laugh yeah, one? The Can't Laugh one, and also they do this, I think they were the first to do it. They're like literally, they get like a bunch of panels and I guess Gact is always on it. It's yeah. the, the pro. Oh, Kakuzuki? Where, yeah, yeah, where they do this thing where every year they'll have they'll give them like two things or three things and they'll be like, which one is the expensive and cheap one? Okay, that's So good. they'll give you that's two wines, good. you taste them mm. and everyone has to pick and then, of course, Gact. I, I, I think it's rigged a little bit. I don't know. It might be a little bit. But Gact rigged, always yeah. gets everything right. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. He's yeah. Gact. He's yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, that is rigged. And, it, and it's to say, like, you are the, you're like the immaculate taste of a human being. Yeah. You have the perfect, most refined taste. Yeah. Every they'll, they'll, they'll do a bit where they'll be like, they'll play the same piece on like a ten thousand dollar violin and a ten dollar violin. They'll be like, which one's the expensive one? Yeah. How would you 
Okay. Yeah, we're just <laughs> <At that> point, <laughs> these celebrities are just guessing. But what's really funny is that like at the start of the show, yeah. everyone starts off as like they have this like subtitle which is like you're an A grade celebrity. Yeah. Because you're just like so refined. And every time you get a question wrong, you get downgraded. <laughs> and the way they treat them on the show oh, just no, gets downgraded. Really that's well. fucking funny. So it starts off like everyone's like has like, you know, really yeah. nice like chairs to sit on and like really nice food. It's and really then the is. more you get wrong, they're just like at the end of it, you just disappear from the frame. It's That's really, really like they literally it's, just edit it's, it's, And it's only on New Year's. It's one, only one. on New it's, Year's. Okay, I really, check really it out. Good. It's, it's really, really good. It's really okay, good. Okay, yeah, we'll yeah. Even if you don't understand anyway. anything, it's so visual as yeah. well that it's it's yeah. really fun. Really good. Uh, it's definitely one I recommend. And there's also the one that I kind of like, and I wish that other countries did this, was the You Are Nani or Shimathka. What is it? The uh, You Are Nani Shin Nihon. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah why, why did you, Yeah, it's basically the show where uh, the, the, the whole uh, idea of the show is they wait at like major airports like Hanado and Narita. Mm -hmm. And then they go up to foreigners coming to Japan and they go, oh, why are you in Japan? Yeah. Okay. And then they go, oh, I'm doing blah, blah, blah. And if they're like, oh, can we come yeah. with you? And they oh. basically tag along with the foreigner to do whatever. And it's not, it's not, it's actually to their credit, not set up at all. It's yeah. literally just like, where do you want us to meet you? What, what are yeah. you doing? I know because I've been stopped twice for it. Oh, I shit. saw people yeah. filming it right where people went out. So I was like- Yeah, oh, that's probably yeah, that. Yeah, that's yeah. what it is, yeah. Oh, wow. And so they, they'll just follow a random foreign person and some- some Just of, them going to their hotel? <laughs> well, no, no, they'll be like, they'll be like, what are you what, what are you coming to this trip? So if yeah. he's like, I'm gonna go fishing on a boat in the middle of the ocean. They're like, okay, tell us when and we'll meet you there. And they filmed that. Wait, yeah. so they it's filmed weird. foreigners that come to Japan? Yeah. Only yeah. foreigners. But I feel like, don't they just, well, I'm gonna go to Shibuya Square. Well, they don't, they don't, yeah. They, they don't, don't take people. Oh, they'll they'll like be okay. asking if someone's like, if someone's like, I'm Something gonna, I'm, I'm coming here to compete in the baseball championships. Oh, okay. Like, yeah. oh, can we follow you? Yeah. Oh, wow. And I guess, cause it's so, this is, this is the, like Japan doesn't like people filming, right? But yeah. if you have massive clout with TV shows, I swear you get let into everywhere. Yeah. So oh, I swear totally. they, they, they just walk into everywhere with this camera crew. Yeah, right. Dude, the um, moment you say like, oh, we're with NHK, TBS, any yeah. of those like- Yeah, 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 yeah. They're like, well, go right ahead, <laughs> all, all please. All of a sudden, all yeah. this yeah, yeah, they're, paperwork they're, was you know, not. And so <laughs> they're, they're just following them. There's some really cool stuff they get up to. Mm, um, I'll check that out, that sounds good. Uh, yeah, that's this really interesting. My favorite yeah. one of those was like the, the guy who had never tried surfing before came to Japan to go surfing in Okinawa. Oh, wow. And it's oh. just like, you follow this dude and he just goes all the way to Okinawa and he's like, yeah, I've never surfed before, but I'm going to try it here. <laughs> and the entire time it's just watching this guy struggling. Yeah, that surfing. sounds bad. I hear it's not that good in But it's really, it's really like I, endearing to I watch. I saw one know? where it was like, this guy wanted to learn, he would planned to learn to make tatami with like a tatami making. Why like, would you want to do that? I guess because- oh, really? <laughs> <that's>, uh, <laughs> I, I, I thought it was kind of neat that, yeah. a foreigner, and that there was a guy and it was literally like a 90 year old guy. He's like, yeah. fucking fine, I'll, I'll help you do it. Yeah. <laughs> he's like, all right. Where, how and he was, how'd you learn that? It's kind I don't know, like but he was with, he was like in this guy's house for like three months, just learning to make tatami mats. <laughs> Uh, I, I found weeb. the one weeb like just going <laughs> 10 levels deep into Japanese. Yeah, I don't know how they find these two. I guess they literally just harass everyone. Like, what are you doing? Yeah, what are you they doing? literally I, just go up to everyone who looks foreign and they just ask. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Um, it's, it's always very, it's a really fun show. Um, Japan has a lot of shows that kind of pat Japan on the back. They're like, they have a lot of food they shows like about yeah, like yeah, everything. Food. A lot of the TV shows they put on, on, on television in Japan are like, about how good Japan is and yep. all the cool things in Japan. Yep. We do not have anything like this in the UK. <laughs> it just does not exist. No, I think you do. We have some that are like, yeah, like historical things. You literally just referenced it earlier with the show moving to Australia and be like, no, I'll- Living no, that's not like, that's more, that's, no, no, yeah, that does yeah. not make the UK look good at all. Oh, okay. it's like, it makes it like, look worse. You could have such a good life in Australia. <laughs> oh, <okay. laughs> look how much more she gets paid. She's like, I decided not to move from Scunthorpe. I like it. And then, uh, yeah, like, no, but that makes it seem like it's just so quaint and lovely here. <laughs> no, the only, the only thing that I think makes the UK look kind of good, they're like, I don't know, they just show off some nice homes sometimes or the antique road There's show. Nice homes? Like, well, <laughs> oh, I remember my mom used to watch antique road Antique road show is a classic. Week. Antique road show is my comfort show. Wait, <laughs> do they have an Australian version or, yeah. or is it the British one? Uh, it's the, We had both. I don't know. Oh, so originally it? they, uh, so antique what road- antiques so are there in Australia? <laughs> <laughs> That's a great question. <laughs> <laughs> the oldest it gets is 250 yeah. years. <laughs> <laughs> well, they just bring in something like, oh, I think it's pretty nice. Like this is a 5,000 year old relic from King Edward the oh, no. Yeah. How did yeah, you find yeah. this in your basement? Meanwhile, the Australian one is like, oh, that looks pretty nice. It's like, yeah, my dad made it last week. Well, like, <laughs> I, I, saw, I saw an article in the UK uh, recently on BBC News. They were like, oh yeah, family finds that garden, a, a garden ornament was indeed World War I shell. <laughs> What? It was an active <laughs> bombshell. That's, and then the story was some dad, some guy's dad found it on the beach, thought it looked nice, painted yeah. it red and just stuck it in the garden. <laughs> 
And then, and this is my favorite bit. They're like, hey, I don't know how someone found this out. They're like, we found a bomb in your back garden. We need to remove, we need to right, like, evacuate course, yeah. the neighborhood. Yeah, yeah. And they're like, no. He's That's like, I, he's like, been I, there forever. he's like, I'd rather, I'd rather die than you get rid of this bomb. And so then they, eventually okay. they convince them where they're like, okay, we think it's okay to take it out yeah. and blow it up somewhere else. Jesus oh, Christ. Or one, or, uh, garden. Yeah, garden or garden. in UK. UK, explosion. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, this yeah, yeah, oh, look one. at this. This is what they were willing to kill. <laughs> this little red thing. This I saw the I saw the picture of it and I was like, this is shit. This is not worth it. It doesn't even look good. good. What? This was a and how the fuck did they have this the most bomb ass looking thing? That looks like a bomb. Straight up. <laughs> that totally if looks I like found a bomb. that just lying on the streets, and I'd apparently, be like apparently when they had like something dirty or something, they would whack it to get like the dirt out. <laughs> 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 Christ. And I was like, this is the most UK thing ever. <laughs> oh, it looks really oh, nice Oh, just though. casually have it a fucking- It never blow. You never hear about like, you always hear people finding that. Yeah, you because if it, it, if it hasn't up blown up in like a hundred years, right. it's not yeah. gonna blow. Well, okay, well, well, just, oh shit. well odds are it's not years. gonna blow you up. Know. I'd win. That is kind of crazy. <laughs> I, no, I'd win. <laughs> <laughs> well, I wouldn't die, but I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I else My Someone neighbor else might. Uh, <laughs> Someone else might. My neighbor doesn't have an enemy. He doesn't have the ego to survive. <laughs> <laughs> Why is, is it uh, sweet when I drink from this? I don't get it. You call everything it's sweet, Felix. <laughs> It's, it's water. I, I feel like you had something else in this and no, it wasn't it's just water. Normal water. It's just, it's oh, just, just water. Like fucked up yeah. taste buds. <laughs> oh, oh, is it? Uh, Okay, sure. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we can just gaslight you. Okay. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's been the whole episode. So. <laughs> <laughs> is, is, there, is there a certain age you're looking forward to? For the for the child? Yeah, sorry. For for I, I should, sorry, for both. Yeah. Yeah, for both. Yeah, for both. Uh, for both. No, it's all downhill for me from here. Well, you, are, you have Swedish genes, bro. Anymore, I, right? I, I, I went to fucking Swedish. Sweden, bro. Everyone who was like 60 looked like they were 40 yeah. and they looked amazing. Oh Fuck yeah, off. you guys went to Sweden. Yeah, yeah we did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three yeah. Den review. Let's well, hear it. Well, <laughs> I, mean, I saw that Norway food wasn't as good. I said no. Norway food wasn't as good. Was, me and both. Me and yeah. Just both say yes, it wasn't as good. It wasn't as good. Okay. Yeah. What else was good about Sweden? There was a lot of, that was so much green. Yeah. Yes. We don't have any, this is trees. That's well, the, all the, the, the yeah, but air more than like, normal. I, I, I yeah, never, no. I've never breathed an air that felt that clean before. Really? And yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it was just nice. Going to Stockholm, I was like, I took a breath. Uh, and Stockholm I, isn't even that clean. That's, it, that's exactly what every Swede yeah. I talk to. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's cleaner than the rest of the world. Yeah. Sure. What the fuck? It only goes up from there. You're like on, they're on the stank side of Sweden. <laughs> stank side. <laughs> Well, I asked you, I was like, you know, wh wh where should I go eat? Cause you, funny enough, you just texted me as I was flying into Sweden. Okay. And I was like, what do I do? Yeah. And you were like, eat this uh, pastry. Uh, pastry? You recommended this. Oh, Kenil Bule. Yeah, and Did I tried it. Did you have I, I, I didn't have it. What the fuck did I told you? <laughs> I told you as well. Did you? Yes. I had said so, Kenil Bule and meatball. I was going right. I fucked up because yeah. I saw it in the airport and I thought, I don't want to get an airport one. Nah. So I feel like I didn't want to, Get it, get it and not like it. One, right? yeah. 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 And then I instead what ended up happening is we had lunch and we had a show, so I didn't end up eating it. But we did go to we that restaurant you recommended. Balls, and yeah. they were That restaurant was godlike. I'm gonna remember meatballs. those meatballs for the rest of my life. <laughs> I, I am I'm genuinely I was in the meatballs. I am genuinely <laughs> no idea. genuinely willing to go back to, to Stockholm just for that meal. <laughs> <laughs> it was that good. Yeah, I remember I told you about the place. I was like, yeah. I don't know. If, because my sister recommended it yeah. for me. First, she sent, she sent a bunch of like yeah. cool hipster plays. I'm yeah. like, I think they just want yeah. like good food. And she's like, okay, this one. But there's only old people that go there. That's how you know it's good. That's, yeah. 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 That's how you know it's good. <laughs> so I'm like, okay. Yeah, I, 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 sp I told people online, I was like, yeah, man, and I went to this restaurant and, uh, and they were like, what is it? I'm like, I don't know if I want to say because I don't know if it's like a, a personal thing. Someone in the comments figured out what it was based off a very vague description. Oh, okay. no idea. I was yeah, like, I guess it's not, it's, Stockholm is not that big. Yeah, I don't yeah think they figured weird. it out. And I was right. like, okay, well, I mean, fair enough. Everyone should get to enjoy it. It okay, was expensive, yeah. but it was really, really good. Right. Yeah. Those fucking Swedish meatballs. <sighs> I mean, I can never recreate them. <sighs> no, <laughs> yeah. no, and neither should you. That was impressive. <laughs> That's too much power. I guess it's like you go anywhere where you get the local dish. And it's going to be better when not always. I'm sure you had not always. meatballs. It's not like in you, Norway. You, no, no, wait, no, 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 no
Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. So yeah. obviously, yes. like actual meatballs will taste. Everything's going to be gone. But, uh, but I, yeah. I've always thought of meatballs as like kind of a whatever dish. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's just meatballs, right? How, how much can you make no, it good? No, the IKEA then, ones are not actually good. We just play along because it's, it's shit. It's actually the last. <laughs> well, the we, last. You, you that's like our just, church. We can't say anything bad about well, it. The, the, we the, the, the like, last time I went to IKEA, I was like, "This tastes like ass. They're like rubbery. They're so rubbery." I've always. Why does everyone gas this up so much? I thought this was. <laughs> no, no, we just have to go along. It's part of the. You gotta take the, the, you gotta take, you gotta take the double use when you get them. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's no way just getting all of them. <laughs> all right, what else was good about Sweden? Let's hear that. Well, we were there for like a day. Well, yeah. I want to hear so that. We didn't. Uh, air was good. That was good. The vibe um, of like the, the vibe. The, the vibe of Stockholm was like fucking really hate Stockholm vibe. Really? Yeah, they're so rude. <laughs> Dude, I, mean, I, I, was, I remember when going back and some fucking. In Sweden, we call him Stek, like a uh, rich person asshole. <laughs> uh, Sushi <laughs> did not, were not like, they weren't the friendliest in Sweden. No, they could fucking, but they, they but have the scooters they, everywhere. Oh, we, we scooters. Oh, we that, that, that was awesome. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, my oh my God, Felix. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Fucking <laughs> chill out, bro. God damn. Bro, it's just a scooter. It's just a it ain't that deep. <laughs> he reacted like we just like this his is, family. They got like, the scooters yeah. in Japan now. Have <laughs> you look, seen them? Holy shit! Like it's scooter. it's this has come full circle. Yeah, I, I think someone you died from the scooter. They got hit by a bus. Oh, I mean, it's, I mean, it's not very safe. <laughs> We'll fix this later. Okay. We'll fix I think you were the one that fixed it originally last yeah, time we yeah, came yeah, on yeah, the yeah. set. it. Yeah, he posted. Well, now he's gonna have to repose it again. <laughs> oh god damn. Gone, poor gone. This is a rough figure. No Sorry. Wait, do you uh, do you hate do you hate he oh, do yeah. you, do you hate e-scooters? I mean, okay, listen, I, I hate them, but I do admit <laughs> I kind of like doing it sometimes. But I, I think they shouldn't be in the city. Why not? Wait, let's not change topic. I want to hear about Sweden. Okay. <laughs> I, I like the vibe of Stockholm because it's like, it has like a quaint feel to it. At least the part that we were at. Okay, Stockholm is cool. Yeah. yeah. So I liked it. Sure. Man, Again, I'm, it's hard to discern. Listen, I didn't spend enough time there. Yeah, that, but, I'm, but, I'm, but I'm going back hours. for the meatballs. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. good. Yeah. Uh, Norway was, was I, I like less if it makes you feel better. Good, good, good. that's good, all good. they want to hear. <laughs> what else? I, I still right, thought Norway was good. Norway, let's hear it, come on. The food we had was okay. It was, it was we, okay. We you to, only yeah. eat food and breathe air? What else yes. did you do? Yeah, well, that's all we had time. <laughs> you just described living. <laughs> <laughs> Although the, my life, bro. Although the coffee shop was way better in Norway than it was in Sweden. Oh, that is oh, uh, yeah. But they had like beets. It was pretty good though, actually. Yeah. I like the beets the most. Well, next time we go to Sweden, what do you recommend? Is, uh, yeah, what are we gonna do? Yeah. What, what are we gonna do? Uh, you gotta go in the summer, beautiful summer. We have this, there's this um, propaganda slander movie called Midsummer. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, it's yeah. horror film. I showed it to you. Why is yeah, it yeah. propaganda and slander? Well, opposite. I didn't know the word. Sorry, I mean English. Slanderous. <laughs> slanderous, thank okay. you. Yeah, we have this beautiful tradition of Midsummer, and they turn it into a horror movie. Oh, really? Wait, <laughs> yeah. what, what is the normal festival? Just fun. What do you normally do? You just do? get shit-faced and go out in the fields with your friends. Ex Fields. <laughs> well, that's what Midsummer was. <laughs> Wait, what do you what do you, you just get shit faced? You just get shit faced. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> this beautiful tradition. What have they done to it? Uh, we dance around the fertility pole and sing. Do you actually? Uh, little frogs. Yeah. yeah wow. Yeah, well, I, w I want to experience. That. Yeah, that's, that's really. Wait, fun. do you actually dance around a pole? Yeah. It's, yeah. Fertility pole. Okay. So yeah, it's it's a. Uh, how how what? accurate is the movie then about nothing? Because <laughs> <laughs> I, I do remember the fertility it pole. Please in Sweden. I watch it. I'm like. Those are not Swedish bushes. <laughs> where, where was it? Did you find out? He's stony or some what shit. Are you, what are you, oh. rain bolt? Yeah, yeah, I was, I was <laughs> like, you know, like, those are stony bushes. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, yeah that sounds fun. I, I, I want to do that. No, if, no wait, but hold on. In Midsummer, don't you eat the fucking surströmming? Yeah, it's, yeah, people usually do. People yeah. actually like the period yeah, blood. Yeah, and it's in, no. the movie? in the movie. In the movie. Oh, in the movie. In the movie. Not real okay. life. Not real okay, life. Is, so so well. is, it, is it the one with the period blood in it? Sirstrom. <laughs> So streaming in the movie, they had like they opened the can. And I don't wait the period. I, we don't need our period blood. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I'm saying. Well, hold on, hold on. People believe it. Oh, yeah. oh, it was in Hungary. Hungary. Oh, Hungary. Now, in Japan, they give you the when you have your first period, people give. I'll oh, sticky hung. Yeah. yeah, which is kind of red weird. rice. Yeah. A little weird. <laughs> Did that? Yeah, 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 red rice. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what? When in Japan there is a tradition where when girls come of age and they have their first period. No, say no more. I don't want to know. They, <laughs> I don't want to. The family gives. Them I said red no rice. <laughs> <laughs> 
Can I pump? Uh, <laughs> how do I leave the podcast? <laughs> I can't skip forward. <laughs> um, yeah. So, there, okay, did so you, you like? Good? Do you like it? Uh, I n- I never actually eat it. It looks vile. It smells like you you will want to vomit, but I just want to try just to say. Yeah, yeah I'm sure yeah. it's good. Yeah. I'm sure it's good. But it's good. I've heard from you like, like Swedish food, like, I'm I've, sure. I've heard from every right. like person who has eaten it on the internet who is Swedish, mm. uh, because I watched a I think it was like some fucking BuzzFeed video where yeah, like, yeah, yeah. they get a bunch of Swedish people to eat surstreaming, yeah. and they're all just like, yeah, this doesn't taste the same when you're not shit faced. Oh really? What's, yeah, that that makes like, sense. you need to be shit faced. Okay, oh, okay. So I go to, I go to Sweden, right? Yeah. What, what do I get? What's the food? What's the meal? What do I got to get? Other than the obvious ones. Other than, no, no, other than just meatballs. That's yeah, too, other than meatballs. Is there anything else? Oh, yeah, there's a lot of, <laughs> a lot there's of nothing. There's just nothing. <laughs> Tacos? What? Yeah, Burritos? Yeah, that's, 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 that's Norway. Tuesdays that's Norway. Or, yeah. or Taco Friday. Yeah, 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 Taco Friday. What the fuck? Yeah, why do they have that in Norway? Well, Taco Friday. There's a Taco Friday. Yeah. Uh, What's up? Was, with that? I think it was, it was like, a marketing. Yeah, it was a marketing thing. Yeah. I think. Yeah, I at least Taco that Tuesday I, does it right. There was, this, like, there was this thing that they were really proud yeah. about in, in Sweden during our show. It was where you um, have like a coffee break or a, a, a break during the day. Oh, uh, during, fika. Yeah, fika. They were, yeah, fika. Yeah. They were really proud about this. They started, yeah, it, it doesn't make sense because it's like they started oh, so screaming. You, mean you just take a break and have a coffee. <laughs> yes, <laughs> we no, but yeah, it's fika. Yeah. But then we we asked the crowd. We were like, "What's what's fika?" And then yeah. they went, "Yeah, fika, fika mentioned." <laughs> that was what they voted as like you get that. Can you learn some <laughs> saft? Oh, that was yeah. what they voted as their number one thing that they do better than anyone else. Oh yeah, yeah. taking a break. <laughs> yeah. Is it that good? Is it chill? Is yeah, it nice? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's hype. Do you still fika now? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> and I don't get it, to be honest. <laughs> Wait, really? <laughs> why a not? Coffee break. Like, yeah. I, I, I fuck with it. Yeah, no. I love coffee. Not? I love but breaks. You do coffee breaks, right? Yeah. 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 So, so I'm fika. Yeah, oh, I shit, guess. I might fika. Yeah, yeah, that one doesn't that's really shit. work for. Yeah. yeah. Is it cool? No, guys, I, I'm, I'm not. I'm not. A, I'm not getting a coffee break. I'm doing a fika. <laughs> I'm fika right now. Fuck so, off. So fika with the bros. Fina fika. Yeah. Also, there was a. We noticed the big rivalry. It seemed like Sweden was just had a rivalry with everyone, and everyone had a rivalry yeah. made in Sweden. That's like, historically Danish people didn't like it. Yeah. Norwegian, especially Sweden and Denmark. 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 Yeah. 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 Yeah, there's a lot of, really? a lot of bad. The we didn't notice that. Yeah, yeah. The yeah, that I know. Yes, yeah. <laughs> there's a lot to hate about. The yeah, Swedes, I, you know? I get it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I get it actually. And the Swedes are just like firing in all directions. <laughs> yeah. like, they're like putting out, they're else. putting out every fire. <laughs> yeah. But no, I mean, it was it was a lot of fun. It was mm. definitely. I definitely want to go back, like to properly experience it. Because again, we I'm just going back. I'm going to that restaurant every day. I realized maybe there's not that much to do. I think about it. Why did you move out? Because there wasn't that much to do. Uh, <laughs> I said it in a bit. It's, uh, it's for everyone else to enjoy Sweden. <laughs> <laughs> I removed myself. Wow, so. what a martyr. <laughs> I, I, I should start saying that about Wales. Yeah. <laughs> what did I leave? To really just allow it to breathe. Yeah. Just give it some space. Yeah, I had to leave some fun for the rest of everyone. Yeah, because yeah, I, I, I was wondering I was about taken out. Uh, yeah, This seems like a pretty nice place. Why would you want to use- I, I was actually to- thinking like, because I just met Marzi and took off. Like, oh, yeah, okay. literally. Oh, <laughs> and I was like, like Bjorn, you better gonna- not do this shit to me. <laughs> I was like 22, I'm done, I'm out. I was yeah. like, damn, you moved to the UK over this? I was like, oh. <laughs> that is a crazy, yeah. that no, is a crazy downgrade. Yeah. <laughs> like yeah. Japan makes sense. But then I was yeah. like, yeah, UK off to Sweden. I was like, oh, that's an interesting choice. <laughs> I mean, I guess it just made you like Japan even more when you go to the UK and you're like, wow, nothing works. For sure. The food's not good. And then I come yeah. to Japan and everything works and the food's great. Yeah, but, but the winters suck in Sweden. Like it's so dark. Oh. You go to school, oh. it's so north. Yeah. What, I remember going to school and like you're at the bus station and you can't even see your friends because it's so dark. And you're like, well, what the fuck, you're here? <laughs> There's, it's just so pitch black. And then you come home and it's pitch black and it's like, oh, Skiing's cool. fun? Yes, we have a lot of skiing. You sound like you don't like yeah. it that much. We don't really have mountains. <laughs> That's Gotta go to Norway? <laughs> yeah. We have, we have Salon, it's like a hill. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a small mountain. <laughs> Damn, Norway really did get everything. They got the oil. No! They got, they, got, they got the mountains. They got the they got the beautiful the Sweden at least have the uh the the uh, Aurora Borealis kind of stuff, or is that all Norway too? They got that too. We get it up north. Okay. Where no one is. <laughs> <laughs> Same in Norway though, isn't it? On the border of Norway. <laughs> Damn. Damn, Norway really got it all, huh? Yeah. yeah. Now I can see why Norway was not really, really beefing with anyone. No. <laughs> they just Yeah, because whenever you see anything on all like yeah. all the things are like, oh yeah, yeah. It's Norway number one. Sweden number two. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
always like, I have no enemies. <laughs> well, yeah, I'd have no enemies if I had all the fucking money. <laughs> I, what the fuck? Why don't they have all the money? It's so unfair. I they got all the money. My granddad said this on his deathbed. He was like, he was just talking shit. And he, <laughs> really? And, yeah, yeah. And Honestly. he was like, Felix, they have no defenses. <laughs> <laughs> Strike them now. <laughs> Take them. Take the land. It's so, time to claim what I'm on a mission. Deserve. It's really why I started YouTube. Does your granddad really go, Felix? They have no defenses. <laughs> Come closer. <laughs> They're open. They have That's three so point fucking four funny. Billion. That's so fucking funny. <laughs> They have nothing. Yeah. Not we have all the weapons. <laughs> They're not expecting it. <laughs> what are they gonna do? <laughs> yeah, sure. I'm just saying, you probably shouldn't joke about that, but yeah, also, yeah. That's, that's the kind of shit I want to say on my deathbed. <laughs> <laughs> just the, mad the talking. Shit post. Yeah, just mad talking <laughs> shit about everyone. <laughs> just say the most unhinged, like not politically correct shit. Yeah. Oh God. Oh my God. Do you still think Sweden, Swedish winters are worse than British winters? Cause I fucking despise British winters. No, I fuck? hate what? it. Yeah. British now winters it's are so, so good. Bad. Huh? Wait, British winters are so good. No, because British winters are the worst. You what? Wait, but you're yeah, saying you, this- Yeah, cause you, okay. You're, you're all saying this the fucking without having south. notice. Uh, you're, you're saying this without having experienced a Swedish winter. I have yeah, also, also gone. You lived in the southernmost part of the UK. You did, you did not <laughs> live in the UK. You lived in basically France light. All right, I want to hear it. You didn't live. I live right no, in the fucking middle. No. It's, no. Yes, no. yes. You also lived in the South. Yeah, you don't know why, shit. That's, yeah. I know how shit it was. Yeah, that's Yeah, because that's, you yeah. were in the South. In the North, we got snow. It was the fucking nice. South, we got, we we just got, got snow. wet. It wasn't, it wasn't even, it yeah, because you were cold, it was wet. Yeah, because you were too no snow. down South to get it fucking snow. It snows once every three years for five minutes. Listen, exactly. Uh, exactly. In the North, it was great. It was cozy. We had snow. It was nah. fun. All right, it was fucking nice. All right, fuck you. Yeah, that's <laughs> <what I'm doing. laughs> Fuck you too. Go back to Sweden. <laughs> okay. That's the tax that we pay for uh, living in the better country. Oh, yeah. uh, sorry, live better part of the country. Sorry. Oh, listen, listen. We North like North. we like being poor in the north. All right. <laughs> <laughs> we love it. It's we a, love it's it. A, it's a choice. <laughs> it's a, we actually don't want money. I've, I've been to Wales and all they had was sheep and hills. So. What do you mean? You said Wales was nice. Why are you turning nice. on me now? Why are you turning on me now? Because huh? you said fuck you. Okay. okay. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> listen, Sweden's cool. Sweden's cool. Yes, we're telling you. <laughs> you went to like the weird, uh, yeah, well you mentioned this to me. You went to like the weird Italian that looks town? Like, it's Portuguese or, or something. Portuguese, oh yeah, it's weird. Yeah, that was cool. Uh, Port, Port that was Port a really Port cool place. Yeah, I, like, cool. I like Wales. But I, I do remember, I don't remember if I said this, I feel like I said this last time, but people were like, this is not my, I posted all these photos, it was all sunny. Yeah. And then I was like, this is not my Wales. We do get like 10 days a year where it's sunny. <laughs> yeah, I think yeah. I went that week. But so I also like the gloominess. It. Cause it really, really no. makes you, okay, hold up. Let me let me say something. Hold on, let what? him cook. Let him cook. It's like what? you probably really appreciate the Swedish summers because the winters are so dark and gloomy that I really appreciate when the but sun's out. But UK doesn't get a summer. Well, okay, we do. <laughs> we do. It's kind of warm. It's, we we have a good one week. Okay. Listen. Yeah, and then it's too warm. No AC, and you're just <laughs> fucked. You're like, this sucks. Bring I, it back. True. Bring back, back the gloom. Comes in. Yeah. Ooh. Uh, well, at least we have crisps. Those are good. <laughs> good crisps. There's crisps everywhere. Yeah, but they suck. UK crisps are by far the best. Did you have them in Sweden? No, what the fuck? Did you have the Estrella, <laughs> sour cream, onion. Mm. Oh, that's what we're there's gonna no, try. We have the dip no too. Shot. You never dip. dip. Dip for crisps? Yes, you what get the, the sour fucking, cream with a mix you of- You know that, that tells me? Your crisps can't stand on no, their own. No, 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 they can't, tells they you. They can't stand on their own. They can't stand no, on their own. No, you get double flavor. No. Fuck, I'm out of this. God <laughs> <laughs> damn. All right, well, I guess all we can right, wrap right. it up there. Yeah, we can wrap, wrap it up, up there. there. He's done, he's yeah, done. Next time. <laughs> slander. He's done. Next time you can, okay. You, can, you should come out firing Such next time. Such trash yeah. talk, man. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Trash Taste. Hey, look at all these patrons though. So they support the show. They yeah. like donkey on Sweden, I'm sure. But uh, hey, if you like to support the show, and then- <laughs> <laughs> The Norwegian <laughs> patrons. Yeah. Yeah. Rise up Norwegian <laughs> patrons. <laughs> Now's your time to shine. Hey, if you like to support the show, then go to our Patreon, patreon.com slash trash taste. Also follow us on Twitter, send us memes on the subreddit. If you hate our face, listen to us on Spotify. And hey, if you'd like to check out this week's uh, brand new Patreon exclusive content, then here's a quick five second clip of it. Roll it, Moonon. Paths of glory. Paths of glory, probably. I think it might be Paths of glory. Nah, Born Supremacy. No, Paths of glory. Do you even know this film? No, but it looks old. <laughs> and if, it, if it's on this list, it's probably a banger. Uh, where's my chat up? 
Uh, <laughs> yeah, go follow this guy. So we found some dad off the yeah. street in Japan. <laughs> so we got to shout out the small aspiring artist. Uh, wow. Do you want to shout out your I'm channel? I'm hard capped on 111 mil sums. So please, guys, come on. <laughs> I'm in 112, let's do it. Come on, 112. 112, come on, let's no, go. Even if you're Norwegian, whatever, just like, please, sub. <laughs> Just let's hate, do it. Just hate sob, <laughs> at least. <laughs> let's do it. 112. Come on, let's go. Yeah. Well, thanks for coming on, Felix. No, it's my right. pleasure. It was and, fun. Uh, we'll Until the last five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. We'll see you guys next week. Bye. Bye. Bye.